Oh, mushy, mushy. Oh my God, is it that time? Is it happened? Has it occurred? Are we doing it? Yes, oh God. This could be one of the most embarrassing things. Am I about to play a game? All world, no, okay. No, but wait, no, today is November 30th. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, wait, okay. 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 That's the problem when you play these these live games, people. They need to be fixed every once in a while, um, or or hot fixed. This isn't the goddamn beginning I've chosen. What what is wrong with them? The, the moon, the moon. That's that wasn't what I wanted. Uh, as you can tell, I am I am I am out of it. Movies and tittles. There we go. A Rome reborn demo and the tittle. That's, uh, I think that's what we're here for. But, you know what? Without further ado, let's watch the opening movie. Let's let's do this right. I need an opportunity to drink my coffee anyways, which is probably too hot. Hi, Dylan. Oh, they talk. Sh shut up, Jordan. A vibrant You're gonna get shushed in a movie. By the light of the crystal. It's always about crystals in these games, isn't it? Azure seas. Always. The westernmost of the three great continents. There lies a realm embraced by gods and forged by heroes. Her name, Aorzia. Is that a person? The annals <clears throat> of Aorzian history chart the rise the of annals. the succession of great civilizations. You hear that? Each one enjoying an age of peace. The astral eras. Look, it's kids! To date, all have proven ephemeral. Uh oh. In the year 1572 of the sixth and most recent astral era, the Northern Empire of Gollumald amassed a great army at the heart of Eorzea, seeking dominion over all. Okay, Darth Vader. Rising in desperate resistance. Pretty ladies. Eorzean alliance met their Black mages. In the field. Yet, even as the battle raged, the lesser... The Death Star. Was it's Star Horse. ...through Imperial Machinations. <clears throat> From its core emerged the elder primal Bahamut, who unleashed Bahamaha. his upon the realm. Now, the only thing I was always trying to remember, um, if, if you're new to this, the devastation brought Aorzea to its knees, and the era is. There's Final Fantasy XIV, and then there was a Final Fantasy XIV: A Realm Reborn, which is what we're playing. It's just sort of the name of an expansion, but. Final Fantasy XIV before A Realm Reborn doesn't exist anymore. Um, there's, there's a great no-clip documentary on it, <clears throat> on, on sort of what Square did to fix the game. Five years have come. Um, but sort of that's essentially it, is, is that's how they played up in-game. Uh, the, the game was changed drastically uh, to, to make it uh, more appealing to people to raise himself from into play. Ruin. Um, so they basically just said Bahamut comes and destroys everything and five years later is what the, the player that we right now get. Stranger to him once more. Yet heedless of what more kids ahead, he shall press on. Chocobos spurred by the promise <clears throat> of peace and prosperity. Amid this period of great change, an adventurer arrives in Eorzea, one whose tale is yet unwritten. What's, which is funny, uh, so I played Final Fantasy XI, the other MMO of uh, Final Fantasy, and, and so apparently May he ever when 14 came out before Realm Reborn, it played a lot like 11. I never played it. I only played a Realm Reborn, um, but uh, yeah, it was it was quite a thing. All right, so now I don't know why it keeps doing this. So now that's the opening movie of of that, and then this is this is what we're 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 sticking with a Realm Reborn. So I don't know if is this the same? 
There's no crystal here. And how on earth do I keep it to keep from that particular thing? See, this looks very similar. Like, is this is this the same thing going on again? Okay. No. Now the Death Star is coming down. But it looks sort of similar to what Bahamut came and, you know, destroyed the city. Or the world, I guess. It's a little bit more context, if I can remember. A little bit more context. And beautiful music. <clears throat> See, it looks like... Literally showing the opening movie that we just watched. several marks on these people. Yeah, it's like, what the fuck? You just hit me with your arrows? Like, what you dick? But see, like, I don't remember that part. Like, you know, they're mixing in things here, which is fine. Uh, so we did choose to start as a an archer, um, which leads into a bard. Uh, we'll, we'll learn all these things as, as we go forward. Uh, there are starting classes, which get massaged into jobs. The jobs are all the ones that you've ever heard of if you've ever been familiar with a Final Fantasy game. Uh, a bard, a red mage, paladin, um, you know, stuff like that, warrior. And the beauty part of this is that you don't have to make multiple characters. If you want to try something, you can try it on one character. You can be anything you want. All you gotta do is change your weapon. Uh, so like I said, I have played this game. I never really played it to any form of completion or anything. Um, I played uh, um, a Realm Reborn uh, back in its beta form. Uh, for, for whatever that's worth, not not anything, really. Um, but I feel like, uh, and, and what happens to a lot of people with MMOs, not just Final Fantasy, um, I, I, I think a, a level of burnout existed. Um, and there was no expansions uh, that I got into. Like, when I look back and, and uh, that we've, we've started a brand new account, a brand new character, my my main character that I I was, um, I I, I want to say like we we just never did anything like if we if we ever truly did hit end game, um, I think at the time I'm gonna have to look this up because I, I, I want to say like I never hit 60 until not too not too long ago like when I sort of got back into it, um, but. If I looked up a Realm Reborn, I want to say I thought 50 was the was the, uh, the hard cap. Realm Reborn. Okay, so it was 50, so that makes more sense to me. Okay, yeah, because I played when there was no expansions, no nothing. So there was... That makes a lot more sense to me. I think I got 50. I, I very much like the process of leveling up. Uh, this is one of the best social MMOs, and, and you'll see when we get there. Um, it, it, they just do so many things right that, that games like World of Warcraft still, after all these years, still doesn't do right. And probably will never do right. But yeah, so again, um, sort of just like the previous movie we watched... Um, you're seeing Bahamut um, coming to destroy the, the the old 
Final Fantasy XIV Worlds. And this is how they do the, the reset. So these are all the, the uh, uh, I guess you could say important characters. I don't know who this lovely old man is who's, who's doing some type of sacrifice for us. Um, but he, he sort of transferred us to, uh, or teleported us to uh, new areas um, so that we were safe. Sort of a, where we're at right now, and I, and I know it's a you know it's a lot to take in at the very beginning of of the game, but you know once we once we sink our teeth in and we get to playing, we'll we'll have some fun. Yeah, I feel like a lot of this was just like what we watched, like the opening movie and then the Realm Reborn movie. But like I said slightly different, but sort of slightly this the same. So as far as I, I've known, this is five years later from the original launch. Um, you know, everyone's happy and, you know, the world goes on type of thing. I believe that is Thancrate. And uh, there's three starting areas. Uh, we will be starting in Gradania. So depending upon what you choose for your starting class or job class um, determines where you start. These guys are like, what the fuck just happened? <clears throat> the kids are okay. The giant people are okay. The humans are okay. That guy with the pointy hat is telling us this way to Harry Potter. So like I said, so we'll be starting in Gridania. There's also the seafaring area called Limsa Lominsa, and I'm sure I butchered that name uh, very much so. And then Ulda. Uh, my memory serves me correctly. Uh, we are just going to be doing main quests. The MSQs, as they call them, uh, or the main scenario quests. Um, so, uh, bless you, Yoshida. That man is the guy that saved this game. Um, and Ulda. So yeah, uh, you, you get you get all these things uh, at around level 15. You get an airship pass where you, you sort of visit other places. But for the most part, that's that's it. So like I said, we we got we got our area. We've already made the character. Unfortunately, and and very fortunately, luckily enough, uh, thank you to people like uh, uh, Ms. Biscuits. Um, that's our character. That is Bastion Omega. We've already made him. Uh, in, in the way I want, uh, we are a Mikote, which is cat person. Um, and now that's, 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 that's the look. Um, we're sure with uh, an archer. So we're on, uh, Excalibur. I want to be on Leviathan. Um, so, uh, we will pay to make a change over there eventually. But, uh, right now it's too busy of a world. So we have to wait, which is which is rather silly, but uh, let's log on in. <clears throat> Always a good sign, not necessarily from a playing perspective, but from from a, from the health perspective of an MMO. You always want to see that the world is full. That means people are playing your game. You know, that, that means that there's there's an interest and, and these don't take long, these cues. So but we'll get into it. We'll get into it. <clears throat> I do remember. I want to say it was like last year when we we sort of had the itch. That number was, was saying like ten thousand people waiting to get in. You were waiting hours. It was uh, it was something. <clears throat> so now you know you sort of get the beginning story. 
it'll be helpful. I just love this specific tune yeah. in, in Final Fantasy games. I, I, I really do. But God! As you can tell, still yeah. fighting yeah. this cold or whatever the hell it is. Wish I could get over it. So we are... The one thing I've always explained or not explained, if you've played other MMOs, something like World of Warcraft, it's easy to explain. Um, when you play World of Warcraft, you're just like a character. You, you're, I don't want to say like you're an NPC, you're a little bit more powerful than an NPC, but you're just an everyday person. And there's a lot of people in the World of Warcraft universe um, that are super important and do all the important things in, in, in the world. In this game, uh, they refer to you as the warrior of light. And, and the, and the difference is you are the almighty, super powerful character. All right. Do you interact with other people who are also super important? Of course, but you're, you're the shit. All these, all these warriors of light that are coming in that play the game, we are the, you know, the the powerful characters that that will help save the world. Whereas in World of Warcraft, it's the opposite. You're you're assisting the other characters uh, to do so. Oi! All right, lad. You're moaning in your sleep and sweating buckets besides. That'll be Aether, I reckon. Some more prone to the sickness than others. No need to fret. They'll soon get used to it. <laughs> Starting Skyrim here, apparently. Moogles! Gotta love them. Show off. Feeling better, Koopo. Ah, you can see us. I had a feeling you could, Kupo. I'm just gonna turn that off for now. We're Moogles, and we live in this wood. <clears throat> so as you can tell, this guy can't see the Moogles. Normal folks can't see or hear us, which makes you feel special, Kupo. And seeing as how you're special, maybe you can tell us something. The wood's been restless of late, and lots of strange things happen. Have you chanced to witness anything suspicious, Koopo? Oh, just hitting the booze there. But of course you haven't. You've only just arrived. Well, there's nothing to it. We'll just have to keep looking. Nice to meet you, Koopo. The Moogle drank it all. He doesn't know what the fuck happened. Verdania is still a fair way off, in case you were wondering. Seeing as you're awake, I was about to keep me company until we get there. Them youngins don't care much for conversation, see? Fremont's the name. Headlands Matrain. Ask yourself, judging by your unusual garments, I'd say you are one of them new adventurers. Am I warm? Yeah, you'd be right. I knew it! Going wherever the wind blows, seeking fortune and glory. Now that's what I call a living. So as long as you can avoid dying, I mean, ain't no secret that adventuring's a risky business, these days especially. What was the first thing that attracted you to it? Hmm. You know... I always could be just the silent protagonist, but uh, 
Who doesn't mind winning some glory? Glory, eh? Oh, if you're willing to take on the task that those other folk ain't, an adventure such as yourself can win fame what coin can't buy. When you arrive in town, you'll want to report to the Adventurers Guild. You can find out everything you need to know about adventuring business in that. Just remember, though, the more important things in fortune and fortune and glory, such as breathing, there ain't no profit in being dead. That's a fact. Go no further. What's this then? Whoa! That guy almost got uh, bagungled by an arrow. What's going on? A uh, skirmish is broken up up ahead with the Exel. Uh, for your safety, you must remain here until. Uh oh. Bloody hells, we shall hold them from here and try to play clear. We have the determined look. The Ixel are the uh, the lizard like people, if that helps. That was too bleeding close. Nice to the Ixo to come on his Woken party, though, eh? Joking aside, it won't be the last time you meet them feathered feet, so you take care, all right? By the by, see, he said it. Is this your first trip to Gridania? Uh, yeah, it is. For all intents and purposes, I say it is. It is! Well then, let this journey and itinerant tell you the ins and outs of your destination. The city of Gridania lies slap bang in the middle of the Black Shroud, the biggest luscious forest in all of Eorzea. Though it ain't near as lush as it used to be, saying that, not since the calamity laid half of it to waste. The destruction prompted a herd of new nasties to move in, gave the Ixel unneeded encouragement. Birdman raids become a daily occurrence. Ah, long last. Behold, Gridania, the forest nation blessed by the element. So like I said... The Black Shroud, the ancient forest close to the heart of Eorzea. Beneath the boughs of its towering trees, lies the woodland city-state of Gridania. Beautiful. Uh, like I said... Once a sanctuary from the <laughs> world beyond the hedge, even the mighty elementals, eternal guardians of the forest, could not forestall the coming of the... Look at that giant Moogle balloon. Era. I'm really excited about this. However, uh, the goddess Nofika was never one to forsake her children, and today she welcomes another morning, DJ. Brave soul. How was your weekend? One who may yet play a telling role in the tale of this great realm. <clears throat> And here's where we part ways, son. Off to the markets to deliver me wares. It's back to the high road for me. Here. I want you to have this. By ways of thanks for keeping me company. Played more Yakuza. See, I always want to say Yakuza, but I've also heard Yakuza, so I'm always confused. Hey, you never did tell me your name, did you? Well, here's an idea. Become the sort of storied personage I can brag about having met, and I'll consider a square. Mm. 
May the matron take him to her bosom. Her bosom, eh? They never want. And in his heart, so serenity. Serenity now. And sanctity. Aren't I a pretty cat boy? And thus, the adventures of Bastion Omega begin. Final Fantasy fourteen. So as I was going to say, we're going to do a, a pretty much a, a an MSQ run. And I really am going to give it the honest, good old college try. There's there's many expansions. Um, and, and I've heard nothing but the best of things in regards to this Final Fantasy story. Um, but for streaming purposes and for my own sanity, um, we'll be doing main story quests or main scenario quests, MSQs. Um, and then that way I can play on my own for my own sanity and do side quests without anybody missing the important stuff like story and if I want to, uh, uh, you know, try up a different, uh, class. Um, also, hi, Ms. Biscuits. How are you? Good. Good. You there? Yes, you. Your face is not known to me. Newly come to the city, no doubt. What gave it away? I am the tournament, a wood whaler of Gridan. It's my duty to protect our nation from her enemies while welcoming those who may yet prove her friends. So, let us see what you are. <clears throat> and uh, also, DJ, you are a witness, so I just want you to be on the on the on the no here, okay? Just just so everyone's clear here. Um, on my other account, um, my my old main, which is which is gone now, um. Because it was cheaper to start a new account and buy all the expansions. I don't know why. Yes, um, I uh, I took my I took my gill, my money, and I gave it to Ms. Biscuits. Uh, the totaling amount was eight point four million gill uh, that I gave to Ms. Biscuits, and I expect no penny less uh, when that amount comes back over. Um, so just just remember that number eight point four million. So if that. Uh, uh, if, if that does not make its way back over to Bastion Omega, um, we know uh, that uh, many gills were lost in the Lalafell sex trade. Is it, there's an ongoing joke about that. No, it wasn't that much. I know we're, we're just being funsies. How was your weekend, Ms. Biscuits? <clears throat> well... The vibrant force nation. So one thing that I actually like, always annoyed me when I would start these games, and I and I sort of learned of like, um, like it's always like adjusting your your UI. I hate it. You know, you gotta make it your own, right? And I finally found like before you start the game, there's a document on your computer or or wherever where the game is, uh, you know, for your character. It saves the UI and all of this other stuff. So I was able to transfer the the old UI that I liked on my other character to this one so that I don't have to mess around and do anything. It should be set up the way I like it. So <clears throat> I hope I didn't accidentally lose the notepad that had the full amount. If I did, I know it was over 3 million, so I'll throw in an extra half a million in there just so <laughs> until I can't find I I want to say it was like closer to like 3.2, 3.3, but I honestly couldn't remember. Now if you're a crazy person like Fiery Biscuits and plays this game with a controller, all the power to you. I'm a mouse and keyboard slut. Um, but uh, this game, I've been told, um, plays extremely well with a controller. Also, my, my buddy Y2Cloud, who I've been trying to get also in to play this. Um, <clears throat> you know, he uses uses that um, so this is it I, I i like i like my little setup it's a, it's all set up I don't, I don't know why some things are here the peloton we, we'll, we'll get some things every shot we haven't even learned anything yet but yeah i like so the reason why i have this particular um this particular setup is because i have a uh i used to have a razor naga mouse but as you can see like it's got a bunch of it's an mmo mouse this is the corsair version 
I like having it set up that looks like my mouse, right? One, two, three is one, two, you know, very simple, not crazy bars everywhere and everything. Um, <clears throat> it does until you forget about the extended hot bars. I've been playing it on hard mode for a few years. Ah, yeah, yeah, like it's all about like with the controller, I guess, like you're holding like an R1 to switch something or you hold R1 to hit up or something like that. We'll figure it out. But uh, yeah, so uh, for, for all intents and purposes, this is our guy. This is our guy. Ain't he a pretty fellow? So uh, we are on Excalibur. Um, as Ms. Biscuits knows, um, she was very nice to uh, give me the uh, the starting funds to uh, when we do and need to just transfer on over to Le Leviathan, which will. I don't think you can probably exchange that gill with me until I do so. So uh, yeah, the click, the clack, the chain stuff, and I just don't, yeah. So, but uh, you get it. So yeah, that, that was a close up of his butt. But uh, yeah, let, let's get into it. So uh, I look forward to, to getting in on everything. So this game has gotten far better since the years have gone on. They've done a lot of things. Um, like I said, I'm on Excalibur, um, but that doesn't stop me from playing with friends that are part of my same home world, um, like uh, Mr. and Mrs. Biscuits. Um, so um, <clears throat> uh, there is uh, those things that they did improve upon which is great but let's go talk to Bertenant and uh get going here oh god coming to Gridania if you recognize as an adventurer in the city state of Gridania you must first register yourself with the adventurers guild <clears throat> okay yeah I'm not on the free trial um when I so it's a, it's a little weird thing because like I bought I should have I should have bought this not too long ago because I haven't played since I bought it at the beginning of the month. So 12 days, uh, you get 30 days when you buy all the expansions or the complete edition as I bought. Um, so I guess I could have waited so I, I could have had some time, but it, it's okay. Now we're truly playing, so. <clears throat> Another green adventurer, I presume. Not as much. You can't allow strangers to wander Gridani unchecked and untested. Before you rush off and begin pestering every second citizen for work, I suggest you make yourself known at the Carline Canopy. That's the headquarters of the local adventures, Guild. In case you were wondering. And I look forward to getting every single name thing wrong. That might not be the Carline Canopy. It might be the... Carline Canopy. I don't... But we're going to get some things wrong, especially Limsa Lominsa. I'm going to butcher that till the cows come home. The Carline Canopy is the building you see behind me. Seek to Mother Mune within and... She will take you in hand. Ooh, she sounds hot. And we've re done a quest. Perfect, yes. I, and most of the stuff I already know. Like I said, this isn't my first time, my first rodeo. So we're going to move on forward and figure life out. <clears throat> Did you do anything exciting, Miss Biscuits, for uh, for your weekend? So right now, and just in case you're wondering, this, this area is not completely dead. We're still in that lull of beginning. Um, so, uh, you know, we're not allowed past here, but, uh, the, the game doesn't open up and to the server until we, we, we speak with a few people first. So <clears throat> believe me, people will pop up and these are all not real people. Well, well, what have we here? <clears throat> a wide-eyed and wandering young adventurer. I'm gonna put your name down at the guild, I assume. Oh, Bjorn's my name, or Mother Mayune, as most call me, and Carline Canopy is my place. As the head of the Adventurers Guild in Gridania, I have the honor of providing guidance to the fledgling heroes who pass on through our gates. <clears throat> No matter your ambitions, the guild here is to help you attain them. In return, we expect you to fulfill your duties as an adventurer by assisting the people of Gridania. A fine deal, wouldn't you agree? To an outsider's eyes, all may seem well with our nation, but naught could be further from the truth. The people live in a state of constant apprehension. 
The Ixel and various gangs of common bandits provide an unending supply of trouble. Trouble compounded by the ever-present threat of the Gallian Empire to the north. And that is to say nothing of the calamity. <clears throat> so just so uh, I, I, I can... I, I'm clear as well as for everyone else. So the calamity is what they refer to as what the movies we watched at the very beginning. The the calamity or, or the, the, the ending of, of the world, as to say. that That's what they... Uh, say in it uh, as we said it happened five years ago so that's when uh, bahamut bahama bahamut uh came on in and and uh opened his mouth and uh let it rain down fire the world even now the wounds have barely begun to heal but I speak to you as if we were there forgive me five years past the Orzia was well nigh laid waste when a dreaded worm emerged from within the lesser moon dalamon and rained fire upon the realm in which this people called the Calamity. Scarcely a square mom of the Twelve's Wood was spared the devastation, yet despite the force extensive wound, not a soul among us can recall precisely how it all happened. And that was a thing, right? Like, outside of the people who were teleported by the old man to safe areas, everyone else was presumed killed. So no one remembers what happened during the Calamity, it's just... All, all people know is that it happened, and they would prefer it to not happen again. <clears throat> I'm well aware of how improbable that must sound to an outsider. It is improbable, but it's also true. For reasons we can ill explain, the facts surrounding the Calamity are shrouded in mystery. There is many versions of events as there are people willing to recount them. Amidst the hazy recollections and conflicting accounts, all agree on one thing, that Eorzea was saved from certain doom by a band of valiant adventurers, which is you, the player. Um, so like if you played the old game before A Realm Reborn, that's sort of, of who they're referring to is, you know, a, a band of valiant adventurers and also the people that were teleported away uh, to start, you know, rushing anew. Whatever else we've misremembered, none of us have forgotten the heroes who risked life and limb for the sake of the realm. And yet, whenever we try to say their names, the words die upon our lips. And whenever we try to call their faces to mind, we see naught but silhouettes amidst the blinding glare. Thus have these adventures come to be known as the Warriors of Light. <clears throat> For you do not feel daunted by the deeds of the legends, uh, we do not ask that you become another warrior of light, only that you do what you can to assist the people of Gridania. Great or small, every contribution counts. I trust you will play your part. All that's left then is to conclude the business of the registration. Here's a quill. Scrawl your name right there. And then get your free fiery biscuit bottle of wine. Oh, and I would appreciate it if you'd use your real name. There's a special place in the seventh hell for those who's amusing aliases. Bastion Omega? And you're quite sure that isn't an amusing alias? And so amusing alias it is Slay! How are you? Very well. This moment forward, you are registered adventurer of Gridania, nation blessed of the elementals and the bounty of Twelvewood. The guild expects great things from you. I'm doing well. I'm doing well. Happy to, to sink my teeth in this finally. Uh-oh. Troubles are brewing. Look, it just arrived. Another goddamn adventurer. Don't you start with that. Adventures are the very slow of Gridania needs. The elder seats here himself, bow this welcome with open arms. Do you mean to disregard her as well? <clears throat> of course not. Lest you forget, it's my sworn duty to uphold the peace. Am I to blame if outsiders being mistrust upon themselves? You, adventurer! Mind you that you not cause any trouble here, or I shall personally cast you out of this realm and into the seventh hell. I'm excited that this is the game you're playing. Final Fantasy has a special place in my heart. It, I, I said it before, I, you know, when we when we literally started. I played this game so long ago 
like before any expansions were were a thing. Um, I never played the original Final Fantasy fourteen. I played Final Fantasy eleven. Um, but I, I played a Realm Reborn right to level 50, never did anything. And I think I sort of got burnt out on it. And I never really did much beyond that. And I couldn't tell you what happened story wise. Like it was literally like, I was just like in a leveling mood and that was all it was. And, and, and that was in many moons ago. And all I've heard from people going forward that <clears throat> this Final Fantasy story that they tell in an MMO is actually one of the best Final Fantasy stories. Heck, even some of the best stories for a RPG, it's it's top tier. Like, like they've done such a good job. So I, I, I'm excited to, as I said earlier, to give it a proper chance this time. Um, a lot of people play MMOs on on stream, and you and you can get sort of lost in in it in, in in every which way and and it, and it's sort of like you know it can get boring i i'm gonna try to make a point of just trying to do the the main scenario quests which is the big story stuff and then that way when i want to play on my own um i can do the side quests and, and and i will have stuff to do uh when when it when it does get me so i want to play this at least once a week if i can you've made a point to have you on stream on my phone while we're out on our morning walk with the pub well there thank you thank you Yes, yeah, Final Fantasy X was also pretty good, but I'm open to having a chance. Yeah, no, I, I mean, I'm also going to start Final Fantasy VIII this week because we just finished Eternites. So uh, we're going to have sort of three games on the go with Cold Steel Four, Final Fantasy VIII, and uh, this. Two Final Fantasies, however would you know. But pay no attention to that outburst. I meant only to counsel you. Suspicious characters have been prowling the Twelves would have laid, and you see... The Wood Whalers feel they can't afford to take any chances. As is often the day with folk who live in isolation, Gridanians are wont to mistrust things they do not know well, and you good self included. You're not, however, given a catalog of extraordinary deeds, no more than a handful of years, the locals will surely welcome. On behalf of the fellow citizens, I welcome you to Gridania. And may you come to consider our nation as your home in time. <clears throat> Best day ever. Yeah. Now then, you may depend on old Mother Mune to teach you a few things that every adventurer should know. And that concludes the in-game tutorial so because you're playing two final fantasy games at the same well yeah it it is it is and and so um, i so was trying um back when i played the original final fantasy 7 um uh, not too long ago um i put up a bunch of mods on it to really make it look the way you know i i feel like they they always really wanted it to look now um uh, without the remake i mean um and so i've done the same with eight the only thing that i was really trying to get to work with eight was there's a voice mod, uh, much like how when we played 7, but I couldn't get the voice mod to play nice with all of the other mods. So I had a decision of either play the game with just the voice mod, or play the game without the voice mod, but all the every single other mod, and I chose just, I'll, I'll talk. I'll, I'll figure it out, so. It'll be good. So main scenario quests, we're finally getting there. So these little ones that have these uh, this little flame around them, those are the quests that we're going to be focusing on. Um, and then those are uh, um, other series of, of duties or quests you can do with a little plus sign in blue. So we will have to do some of those to move on with life uh, just because of the way it works with leveling and whatnot. We might not be high enough, but... I know that there there were things that they added on in these games to, to sort of get you to move quicker uh, through uh, the story. Uh, you know, like there's there's a little bit. So we got our we got our first shot, and we're gonna get our, our, our first real quest. <clears throat> I'm sure I'm gonna have to slay some squirrels or something. Let us begin at the beginning, shall we? Now that you're a formal member of the Adventures Guild, we must be sure to have a firm grasp of the fundamentals of adventuring. To that end, I have three tasks I wish you to perform. First, visit the Atheroid, the big crystal. 
stands in the middle of the Aetherite Plaza, not far from the Carline Canopy. A device that enables instantaneous transportation. The Aetherite plays a key role in the life of ever wandering adventure. Oh, and Ms. Biscuits! I did put in the, the friend code, so I don't know what that gets us. If everything works out or whatever, or if I have to sub and then it gets things. Um, I can't remember what it said, so. But all we need to do is just touch the crystal surface. And a member of the Wood Whalers will present and offer a further instruction. For the second task, visit the Archer's Guild. No better place to learn the arts and farts of the bow. Speak with Aethlina, and she will explain the benefits of joining the guild. If you can't tell, we have a bow. Always appreciate a range class in an MMO. And for your third and final task, I would ask you to visit the markets at the heart of Old Gradania's commercial district. There you will find weapons and armor and the various items that an adventurer might need on his travels. There is, however, more to the markets than buying and selling goods. Speak with Harse Mantra and listen well to his counsel. <clears throat> Master Merchant can be uncooperative at times, so be sure to offer him one of my famous eel pies. Like so many men, he is much more charitable when his stomach is full. Here, I made a batch not too long ago. You have your task, Bastion. May no fika guide your path. Oh, and one more thing. Should you happen to come across any citizens in need, don't be afraid to proper a helping hand. I am certain they will be pleased to meet an adventurer whom they can confide their woes. Granted, their work is awfully uh, unlikely to be realm-shattering importance, but prove your worth and build a reputation, and in time, folk will be more inclined to entrust you with matters at the moment. <clears throat> And yes, you should also get sub bone. Okay, perfect. I always... It's funny, like, I think there is a place for both... Art styles for MMOs. If, if you know, I've played World of Warcraft, I've played this. I like both the styles, and I think both of the styles work. Um, it, You know, it really is a personal preference as to what you prefer, whether you prefer the... the the more realistic approach that Final Fantasy does, or the more of a, a cartoony Disney approach that World of Warcraft does, both work in 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 their own manner. But I, I know certain people are just like, oh, like they. I, I know people hate the cartoony graphics of WoW, and and you know would prefer something to look like this. And then there's people who, you know, think this doesn't look that great and would prefer a cartoony look. But I suggest you lend an ear to the Smith gear in the canopy. Smiths are trusted representatives of the Adventurers Guild and are an invaluable source of advice for neophyte heroes seeking to attain greatness. <clears throat> I'll forever be a sprout. Okay, I had always wondered if they were ever going to do that, um, which would be really nice. Uh, you know, great to see them taking advantage of um, some big horsepowers that's going out now. So that'd be good. So we know how the main menus and everything works out. So, and navigation, I know how that works as well. But again, it's nice to have it. So, <clears throat> it took almost three years to see Cat Boy. Well, you know, there you go, right? Thank you, Thank you Mr. Wolfsler. Shouldn't you be at work? I mean, I assume you're out uh, walking a doggo, but uh, thank you, my friend. I feel like we tried this not too long ago, but we just didn't get there. But like I said, I'm gonna I'm gonna give it a, a good try. Hello, hello, Kiko Eclipse. You have you have you have, you have Rudolph. Onboarding. That's no much for me. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Fair enough. Everyone has no clothes on, by the way. Like. I mean, the true end game of this is truly the fashion. But as you can see, there's more people now. So, like, I'll I'll pick up these these small quests, you know, things from Bernadette, uh, to sort of get things going, so we have things to do. But for the most part, once we sort of wrap up and get onto a good little move on with the main uh, main story quests, uh, we'll continue on. I am new, Bernadette. I can find someone standing a vigil before the archers go. Well, this so happens I'm going to be heading on over there. So, uh, 
we'll make sure to uh, get them onto them. Thank you. Then this is the giant crystal that we're supposed to touch and everything just goes wonderfully. And we are now attuned to the Aetherite. Greetings, adventurer! I see you faithfully followed Mother Meun's instructions. I'm sorry? Allow me to offer you a bit of instruction myself. I'm Missia of the Wood Whalers, and I know a thing or two about the Aetherite. Yes, the big crystal right there. Aetherites are devices that tap into the ethereal energies and are primarily used as a means of travel swiftly from one place to another. Return and teleport are the most common transportation spells, making direct use of Aetherites and their connection to the flow of the Aether. And as these devices are found in almost every corner of Eorzea, any adventurer worth their name will wish to seek out and attune himself to each one. Truly few things in this world are so useful to an intrepid explorer. But we need not locate them all at once. Or rushing into the wilds, I suggest you start with Aetherites found here in Gridania. Should you wish to learn more about the Aetherites or transportation magic, I'm here to answer your questions. <clears throat> so, now that we can return, we can return here. Our home, Crystal. So there's little uh, crystals, which I will show you, um, that they want us to get to. So that we fast travel to each little smaller area. Um, so like their big one is here. And then, uh, you know, as we travel around, so we do have some quests. Let's just open up that map and just get a general idea. Uh, there's quite a bit to do here. So uh, <clears throat> I'm not going to be like, uh, I don't know like what I should learn. Like if I want to learn to be a carpenter or, or anything like that. And, and there are other things to grab here. So, uh, but uh, yeah, so basically for this area, the only one there is the Archer's Guild. That's a small crystal. And then we can grab a couple of these uh, small quests. So we'll go and do that, and then we'll head on over to the Archer's Guild. Okay. We're not good enough for that quest here. So how many weeks do you have of onboarding there, my friend? Preserving the past. Been looking for an adventure to deliver a forgotten item. I think I might be able to handle that. Not a moment ago, we dispatched our newest recruit, Artor, to inspect Miketo's amphitheater. Regrettably, the young Hayur is more spirit than Sans, and he charged off without his tools. Suffice to say, he won't be getting any work done. Wouldn't you be so kind as to deliver it to him? Sure. Uh, maybe two or three weeks is my guess. Okay. Seek out Lou Helic in the acorn orchard behind the atrium. We should have our tours as well. <clears throat> and is it roughly the same type of job you were doing previously? Just different company? Or is it, are you still working for Mr. Biden? Idell sent you. Give me a moment. Here they are. Still fresh and unused as they I got them. Doubt he's even realized the bloody thing's behind. First day and he forgets his tools. Daft needs sods. Picking the key. Oh. We don't need to be kicking people in the in the crown jewels. Uh, sort of same general title, but my last job didn't give me appropriate work for my title. This one will. Okay. Well, that's good. That's good. But at the same time, like, I'm also like, oh, I could do. Like, I do want to keep some side quests. Purely for the point of when I want to play. So I should probably just, we'll do things on our own time. Go side quests. I'll, I'll take care of the ones we have, but uh, yeah, we got lots of places we can go visit. Lots of places. All right. So here is one of those lovely little uh, Aetherite shards. Just touch it and we'll be able to teleport. <clears throat> I need to know nothing about this, and I can sprint. And I ran. Yeah, I just don't know if we're going to run into the issue of will I need to do these side quests to level up? It's been a while since I've played it, so I'm just going to get these 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 little side uh, smaller shard things, and then we'll go. 
This game does a lot of things right. The music is wonderful and magical. Chancho Hancho! Small Lala fell. Now, that is one thing that you will notice. People are indifferent to these, um... How do I say? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I feel like I'm being watched. What does that mean? Someone dotes upon me. That's not them. Oh my god, I'm being watched and I don't know. Oh god. Where are you, Rowan upstream? There you got. There you are. A bunny person. I could have been a bunny person. I really could have been. That is, uh, that. They found us. That, my friends, I don't know what she's doing. She is, she's high. And that's what you do in every MMO. You, you just jump to show, are, are you, are you okay? That's a, uh, wait, can I, can I actually play dead? What is, oh, play dead, play dead, right? Play, play dead. I cannot play dead. I'm just, just dead? No. I haven't learned all of these wonderful things. Hello! Oh, I forgot. I, I don't get all of the emotes. I have to get the emote. Yes. Um, so I guess the thing is, <clears throat> oh, that person paid for the emote. Um, I was going to ask. So that, as we can see, that's a cat person. That is SGM Fiery Biscuits. Um, we do plan on um, moving to Leviathan, which is the, the server that I was always on. And that uh, Rowan Upstream and Mr. Uh, Biscuits is a part of. So if I send your friend request, um, it should all be good, right? She's just going to ignore me for a week. Wait, so uh, and then they appear in a wonderful orange. Oh, that's t that's terrifying, Wolf Slayer. That is terrifying. That is absolutely terrifying. Okay then, just leave that dead person right. Now I'm unsure of anybody now. I mean, I do remember the names of friends. Surprised you hadn't noticed, but she was darting out of your view for a while. No, I, I, does it shock you at all that I wouldn't have noticed that at all? Come on now. Come on. And what, your name was, was Koromaru, right? I I have to I have to hopefully be blessed back in to the uh wonderful welcoming embraces of the um I wanna say guild, but it's a it's a free company, I believe. A free company. Um I'm trying to think of just like the all right, I, I guess we'll just get that one and then we'll just work our way. There's a lot there's a lot that this game is asking me to do and I and I have to like fight every urge in my MMO brain to not pick up every quest I see. Like, it's hard. <clears throat> um, Koro, wasn't that the name of the dog in, in Persona 3? Maru, I can't remember. Maru, I can't remember. Unless that's the name of the dog. Oh, okay. See, I'm not that stupid, but I, could, I I thought maybe Maru was something different. Maybe. Oh, yeah, Carpenter, eh? Hey? Roots Toolbox. I'll take uh, handing these over to you. <laughs> Ideal sent you with my tools. I was actually just about to go in. Uh, it's so embarrassing. My apologies. It's just been so focused on the task at hand. You know, it's a miracle the Amphitheater even survived the calamity. It was Carpenter's Guild that saved it, moving it piece by piece and rebuilding it. I saw they had redone for it. Redone, yeah, I knew that I wanted to be. But gods, when they told me my first task was to come here. Anyways, thank you for bringing me my tools. You're new to the Oak Atrium too, right? Well, let's both work hard and for the good of the guild, eh? I didn't know this guy was Canadian. Oh, and uh, may the elementals watch over you and keep you safe. Thank you. I already know how to handle it. 
Hot sec. Yeah, go get a beverage. And, and and of course, I, you know, I, I like Mr. Wolf Slayer. He's a he's a, a wonderful person. I'd, I'd like to give him the, the the benefit of the doubt of he knows what's coming. So if you would like to plug your ears, um, you know, I don't want you to hear that, <clears throat> but I have to do it. You know, it's 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 like in my it's in my Twitch contract that I have to do this. It's it's. Five o'clock somewhere, and I feel like my raspy voice um, really does add to it. I really wish I still didn't sound like I just finished a carton of Marlboros. Uh, or no, wait, did I just, did I just say Marlboros? Aren't is isn't that is, are those also a brand of cigarettes as well as a Final Fantasy um, enemy? I look forward to the. Many dungeons that we will get to do with the, the these these friendlies. It'll be fun. Um, all right, moving on. I do love the look of this game. Like it's when I remember playing World of Warcraft, it doesn't have like that, like that scope that you can really take in although the argument would be is like well you can't you know you can't really go everywhere in Final Fantasy when you could in World of Warcraft you know you, you want to go up to that that mountain you can go up on ahead that mountain if you'd like but uh, now that they did add flying in and everything it's it is sort of different all right here is Pars Montre if, if I say this name correctly by what right does a fledging adventurer presume to address Harsh Mantra, master of the markets? Think you can stroll on in here, bold as you please, and demand my hard-earned knowledge? Ha! Merchant does not, not especially when dealing with would-be heroes. If, on the other hand, you had some tasty morsel to curry my favor, then I might consider your request. I, feel, I have a feeling this guy might like some eel. Come now. To encounter reeks of Mion's handiwork, and more specifically, her baking. Surprise, son. I smelled that eel pie from your mom's away. Hand it on over. Okay, okay, relax. Hmm. Waking across just a vine. Very well. I'm a man of my word. Pay close attention, for I'm only going to explain this once. Aspiring adventure need no look no further than the Rosewood and Ebony Star. Both are but a short stroll from where we stand. But if you mean to do battle, you'd best be prepared with a quality set of weapons and armor. Such goods are the province of the Rosewood Stalls directly south of here. Pleased to learn that the merchants of Gridania are exceedingly particular when it comes to craftsmanship, and so you needn't fear defective straps and the like. Could you imagine in a game that you would have to worry about buying shitty products when you just go and hope to buy something from, uh, you know, a, a piece of armor or, or, or an item from someone like, oh, this one's shittily made, uh, so it's only going to do half. If it's potions and paraphernalia you seek, north to the ebony stalls. Looks exactly the same as the rosewood stalls. <clears throat> The shelves are lavishly stocked by widely traveled Uldanian merchants, and let me truly say I have seen amongst their myriad wares that I scarce knew existed. 
I found a money memo. And, uh, you know, Wolf Slayer, also a um, witness. 8.3 million gil should be written on that memo. Be following me thus far? First step in any purchase is to select the stalls that meet your needs. And then, you may concern yourself with price and profit. There's a little bit more I can teach you with mere words. Go, or use the stalls and see for yourself what wares they offer. There's no substitute for first-hand experience after all, and I am weary of talking, and does you have another eel pie? Funnily enough, you have to worry so much more about shitty products if you start an ool dot. Wait, why, why is that a thing? Ah! Oh God. Oh God. Am I about to get paid? We're gonna be here a while. Uh, you can only change so much. Oh, oh, and we got a fat cat. Oh, I didn't know I would be getting gifts. Uh, we're gonna have to do this trade eight more times to get to my 8.3 million. We got minions. I'm reading things. <laughs> oh, I was hoping every trade of a million gil would come with a fucking minion. Sorry, I'm wrong about it. <laughs> She's not going to give me that last couple million. I am now rich, and I may be able to afford a home sooner or later in here. Boy, right to the T. Right to the penny. Thank you ever so much, uh, Ms. Biscuits, for uh, holding on to that. Uh, I believe you forgot uh, some of the interest that was expected. Why, you know, in, in two weeks' time, you didn't put my guild to work? Guess not. Thank you. Well, we got ourselves a fat cat. I mean, I guess technically should be true, right? Now, I've always been a fan of and, and, and all these games walking around with a minion so i get myself a fat cat the best of the best on we go <clears throat> yeah i think we discussed earlier i i could have i could have afforded a house i think maybe an apartment but uh, that was all for my my main character so it's nice to know that i have money to go forward What's everyone think it's gonna get game of the year? I, I assume it's gonna be Tears of the Kingdom. What else was a big game that came out this year? Uh, I don't think there's anything over there. I think we have that one. So we're gonna go south to uh where's that guy? It's not here, I guess. God, terrifying. He's just, just always watching me. <clears throat> Final Fantasy 16 was not nominated. Hey, 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 hey! Can your glowing uh, summon help? Help! Help! Someone CPR. Oh God, she's alive! Yay! Oh my God! It's like I'm at a strip club. Oh god. Wolf Slayer's gonna come and find me and murder me one day. Wait, wait. Some Mario game? I mean I haven't played it, but I've seen it being played. Super Mario Wonder? I mean it's a good game. It is. It is. I mean, they're they're basically just doing what they need to do, right? Wait, where's this? Where's this? Where's this guy? This good adventure guy. Oh, he's. Oh, he's. Never mind. He's here. He's here. <clears throat> yeah, I was watching Witcher Mad Max play Super Mario Wonder. It looks good. I mean, it was like, it was more Mario. Like that's what it was. It was just Mario. You want Mario? That's that's what you get. Does, uh, does Justin still play this game every once in a while as well? 
And now that we've gotten all of these small shards, we can now travel um, anywhere and everywhere we need to do so. So that is great. Yeah, so now, so now that I'm on a new account, um, I just have to redo and get your friends, like I said, get back on into the free company as well. It'll all be, it'll all be good. <clears throat> Bernadette sent you to me? Huh. Well, inexperienced or not, if you wish to prove your worth to the people of Gridania, you were right to come. You do wish to prove yourself, do you not? Of course I do. The man has somewhere around 20,000 hours in the game of course he plays. I wish I, uh, I, I wish I didn't uh, basically just uh, shut down my old account to take a look at how many hours I had, but you gotta start somewhere. You gotta start somewhere. So I think what I will do just for, that guy looks cool. Um, I will do the quests that are gonna come in here at, at the Archer's Guild, where we're gonna get some proper, uh, you know, gear for ourselves. Is this the guy that wants me to, to murder uh, mushrooms? Fun guys, fun guys. No, they're causing trouble and ruining crops. How dare they? Oh, I'll, I'll take care of them. Keep their numbers in check. Me and my fat cat here. Well, if you want to prove yourself, go to the central shroud and exterminate six of the pests. But be careful. They might fuck you up. <clears throat> Game of the Year nominees are Alan Wake 2, Balder. Oh, that was the one I was trying to think of. Baldur Gate 3, Spider Man 2, RE4, Super Mario World, Wonder, and Zelda. That is a good list. I, I feel like RE4 could have been replaced by Final Fantasy 16. Um, But pretty much that does sound like, I mean, those are all great games. I have not heard anyone really say something bad about them. It's a little weird that Alan Wake 2 is in there, but I, I haven't seen people play it. I played the first one. It was okay. It was okay. Course correspondence. Might you have a moment? I always have a moment for you. It's, are you, is she my girlfriend? You know, just the, you know, the cat ears, <clears throat> the pigtails. She's an archer. I'm in need of a trustworthy soul to deliver a missive to Parnell. You find her in the shaded bower in the midst of the markets. Hmm? Why would I not simply go and speak to her myself? But, I mean, as I'm sure you have observed, Gridanians have a tendency to be rather, uh, I mean, in person they can be, uh, well, a little bit on the prickly side. This matter is not urgent. Simply hand over the missive next time you find yourself in the markets. And please, as a favor from one adventure to another. I think I can handle that. Um, Ruth Surprise Alan Wake 2 is up. And yeah, I'm like that too. Like RE4 is just a remake, but it, yeah. Hi. Look, she even waved at me and everything. Greetings, friend. Have you found your way to the Archer's Guild? Do you seek to uncover the secrets of our arts? <sighs> I think of it. You do have the look of the one who has received Mother Mune's gentle instruction. Very well, I shall give you a little brief introduction to archery and the Archer's Guild. Best RPG nominees are Baldur's Gate, Final Fantasy 16, Lies of PC of Stars, and Starfield. Again, you just have to remember, whichever one pays Jeff Keighley the most money wins. That's how it always is. The skills practiced by our archers allow them to gauge an enemy's weakness from afar and turn the tide of a battle with a single well-placed arrow. Should you join us, you will be taught to do the same. Archery is practiced in Gridani was born of two distinct styles of bowmanship. The first was devised of the longbow centuries of the Elizin, uh, those are the elf people, and uh, once ruled the lowlands, while the second belonged to the shortbow hunters of the formerly nomadic Mikotes, those are the cat people. As you will doubtless be aware, both races ultimately came to call the Twelve Slid home. I'll symbolically eat a hat if Starfield wins. I've heard nothing but bad things about that game. Um, Ms. Biscuits, do you have a succulent hat that Wolf Slayer could eat? I know he said symbolically, but I want him to really eat one.
like a cowboy hat. With time, the bow was used primarily for hunting, but as hunters fell for one another to prove who was the better shot, they emerged a group of archers. Someone's putting a bunch of things on me. Well, you don't wear hats. And, well, not even a, a toque when it gets cold? You're not Canadian. Not from Minnesota, eh? But that's how the Archer's Guild was born from the ranks of the Trapper's League. That is the way of the guild to promote greatness in archery through friendly competition and results of our methods can be seen in the vaunted archers gods quiver many of whom spent their formative years losing arrows at the guild's practice butts said butts someone is like touching me from beyond well i hope this gives you a better idea of who we are and what we do oh ho do i see a spark of ambition flare within your eyes if you do wish to draw a string with the finest archers, look no further than the archers. Guild. But before you can enlist, however, you must gain the approval of the guild master. And once you are ready to proceed, speak with me again. We can begin seeking about your enrollment. <clears throat> I think there's someone out here. Some... Maybe it's just someone being nice walking by me, just doing some fun things. Sure, could have been. Well, I would love to join the archers guild. I did pick to be an archer, and we're going to get some five braised papira. Whatever the fuck that is. Oh, uh, Ms. Biscuits, when you saw me, I I, I have it all turned off because I find it distracting. I am a sprout, right? Like, I have the little sprout thing above my head. I guess I could just go to my character configuration and see it for myself. Like, Winter Dawn's a sprout. There they go. All right, we, I would like to join the guild. Let's see, uh, character configuration, uh, character. Let's play head gear, which one? Um, UI settings, no, maybe. HUD? No, Arte list, no. Fuck. No, no, no. Display name settings, there we go. Oh, when targeted, so I just had to target myself. No, I can't target myself. God damn it! No, I only have it turned off for myself. There I am. I am a sprout. Lucian, the guildmaster. <clears throat> you would be considered a sprout if we're going by game experience, right? Okay. Well, I am still technically a sprout, so. Uh... We're going to get into the enabling of the auto-advanced text stuff because my voice is killing me. And if I read anything more, I'm going to lose my mind. I mean, I'm still going to read some, but um, yeah, I would love to join your ranks there, Lucian. That's the master of the archers guild. Hi. Well, we're going to learn the basics of farting and the foretaste of which they teach of how to fart at the guild. <clears throat> Obviously, the bow's greatest advantage is its range, so you can shoot small squirrels from afar. And although it's not the most destructive force, like a sword or a spear, it's got some applications that compensate for its shortcoming. You can hit a leg, if you will. I mean, quite frankly, the only reason we chose to be a, an archer slash bard is because... There will be a time where we get to look. Like a pig. A proper <clears throat> No. A furry hat. Feather in our cap. The droopy drawers. Did you just call me a half-wit? I mean, look at... I, I, I mean, I have wonderful... I really think my 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 makeup, my hair, it's, 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 it's the same as my hair. I have scars from, from a, a, a terrible childhood or something. 
I really do like the look of it. I love the customization that this game does offer. It is wonderful. I mean, and that's the true end game, right? Like, you know, after we after we do all of the fun things of it's five o'clock somewhere. It sure is, cat. It sure is. How are you, cat? I will dedicate myself to farchery, yes. And I think, you know, if I was in real life a cat person, this is what I would look like. I would strive to look like this. <clears throat> now, this man wants me to... Uh, woman, sorry. Screw that up. Squirrels, ladybugs, and more mushrooms. I don't know what this the, these people have against mushrooms, but they want me to fuck them up. A case of the Mondays? Oh, no. You know, you could have just uh, called in sick there, cat. My character started as an Elizin because I wasn't sure if I'd like the game, so I didn't purchase the expansion with Vera until... So, I, as I said, I I made the character before uh, we, we, we got all started and everything. I, and I know we discussed it. I probably would have been... A Viera, but two things, and, and the one we discussed. One is they're a little too tall for my tastes, and two, the hat thing. Like, so because of the ears, I don't know why they can't do, like, the cat. Like, I have ears. You might even move them for us here. But, like, I can wear hats, and they, and they make the ears stick out. I don't know why they, they don't do the same thing with the... With the V, with the Viera. Yeah, I read that uh, the 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 cat people are the most uh, popular race to play as, especially in Jamaica. You know, you're a terrible hider. You're a terrible hider. That bastard. He's, he's hot though. She's hot. They're hot. Everyone's hot in this. Jen! God! Where? Are you kidding me? You! I swear to God. I swear to God. I can't. I can't. I can't. So you get. Even though you can see the name, I still almost just. So the, uh, if you're wondering, this, this this person blowing some kisses at me, this is Wolf Slayer. Over here is 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 Miss Biscuits hiding. Wonderful. Um, I remember a thing of like, so on my older other account, you got a Fantasia. The Fantasia what's allow you to change your um, you know your appearance if you want. Was that something that you got later on? I couldn't. I thought you just got one in the mail or whatever, but uh, I couldn't remember. God, these goddamn people. Coral, were you always a woman? Not that there's anything wrong with that. I just thought I'd say. You get one free Fantasia for finishing the realm. Oh, okay, so that's where I got it. So I did. I did have proof that I actually did finish a Realm Reborn story. Um, I just don't remember anything that happened. And another 20 minutes, really? God damn it. I'd be, I'd, if I was like a, a legit, I'd, I'd be so dead. Greetings, sir. Might you be looking to secure the services of a retainer? Uh, actually, I have a, a, a message from... Oh. A missive from Formalabibidus. Yes. Well, whatever could be. A, yeah, I'm so, so are you still feeling a little bit better than you were, Cat? Or uh, is it, uh, you know, still on the road to recovery? <clears throat> what did you just put on me? Well, something that hardly warrants a letter, much less hiring a courier. Well, you're healed. Well, good. I, I mean, did did you did you go down the, the world of, of, of Jordan healing? Where, you know, a little brown liquor will, will do anybody good. Mm -hmm. 
I, I mean, I, 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 maybe that's why I'm still sick. Because <clears throat> I haven't, uh, I haven't decided to sweat it and drink it out. But, uh, you know, hey, look at that. 100 gil. Add it to my millions that I have. Just rest water and chicken soup. Now, now, cat. instead of broth, it's still brown, but if you put in a little, oh, it might hit the spot. You know what I'm saying? Um, I feel like I'm being followed by more than just two people. You always forget how nice being unhealthy. Yes, exactly. Okay, so now we're gonna murder some people. Some fungars. Snacky. Yes, snacky indeed. All right, so let's go kill some things. Let's go level up beyond level two. Let's run away from being followed. Although they can teleport anywhere. <clears throat> it's terrifying. Are, are you wearing a, a hoodie? What? Oh. Yeah, isn't there like a, wasn't there like a Falls Guy event or something? Oh, I should probably hand in that quest to Mother Mion, just in case she also wants me to murder some fun guys. So what is, wait, this person's got like a, a, a flower, but it's like, it's bloomed. Does that mean they're they're helpful? Well, I mean, they're part of the cucks. Okay. They like watching me. Or anybody, I guess, for that matter. The Conquering Hero Returns. I have completed your three simple tasks. So, yeah. Anything else you got there for me? Mom. took the time to listen to these yes unfortunately these people have real problems and i had to play courier for some of them it, it was it was quite ridiculous actually now is there some type of uh you know guild i can sign up for beyond the adventures guild where i'm gonna get money all the time you know a stipend perhaps And so fortunately, uh, for this week, I am off this week. So I do get to uh, enjoy. Oh, wait. So that's in red. So let me guess. Level four. Okay. So we got to go and do some things. Go murder some, some squirrels, some ladybugs, and some forest fun guards. We'll have to discuss schedules if you want assistance with further. Yeah, like when we get there, like I know the game is offered uh, a few things to do. NPCs can fill the spots. I know that's a thing. Um, but even when I was playing before, when I decided to make this this character, um, you fuck what that squirrel over duty. Um, I never really had a problem finding groups. Um, but I know it might be an issue if um. You know, maybe later on, like, story raids or whatever. But uh, we can figure something out by then, obviously. Achievements, great stuff. Who doesn't love achievements? Motherfuck. What, do you have a motorcycle? You hear that potato purr? Fingers crossed that persist queue times haven't been too awful, but that can change sometimes. And yeah, and, and, and another thing too is like, if I do want, what the fuck is this thing? What? 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 What is going on here? Is this, is this, do I have to change the, the, the rating of my stream? 
Is this what happens at furry conventions? I thought this took place behind uh, closed doors. Anyways. Did I? Sorry. <clears throat> oh, never mind. Never mind. I'm an idiot. It didn't put heavy shot there for me. I was like, I was trying to shoot something that that wasn't letting me shoot. There we go. All right. These things are easy, easy. Get some experience. I don't need everything explained to me. Finding items. Can you imagine dying to one of these things? Like, I'm sure it's happened. Like, it's, it's gonna be embarrassing, but geez Louise. This is always the thing of like, when I've watched other streamers, whether they play World of, everyone's playing World of Warcraft, by the way, now. Uh, Cause everyone's playing in the same fucking streamer, you know, guild. Um, but like when you're like, I don't know how people play like when you're a, a streamer, like not popular like myself. Um, like I don't get like, they don't get anything done. Like how on earth do you expect to get anything done? Um, I did. I think I've played a, a couple of streams of it. I always want to go back to it, Cat. I just uh, have have not gone back to it. But it 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 is it is, uh, it, is uh, it is something that I, I do want to go back to and play. That in Hades. And three houses is the first one, right? Because there is two of them. I do want to play both of them. Just seeing these 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 people follow me is is, is unnerving. They're like my bodyguards. I, I will always be protected. Always. Did you just throw like pocket sand at that thing? The bait system, I remember that. God. All right, so we do have uh, another area we're in. We're in the Jadeite thick. I guess we could do that. Uh, make our way down to the Bent Branch Meadows. Probably should grab that quest that's down there because we're going to have to do some things eventually. <clears throat> oh my fucking God. Look who showed up. Uh, what is AW2 for game of the year? AW oh, Alan Wake 2. Never mind, I'm not an idiot. I mean, I am an idiot, but... Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we have been graced by the presence of royalty. King Charles is here in the chat. Idle initiatives. Holy fucking God, my God. I, I am not worthy, my friend. How are you? Good to see you, my friend. Well, you're looking for a lad to track down some twin adder initiates. Why don't you fucking do your own fucking hard work there? Okay, how about that? Sending me out, the new guy. I could, I could, I could die. And you, uh, you have uh, what? Uh, Bandit seeking volunteer materials. What? All right, maybe we can do. That. You want me to uh? Get some bog yarzen shells. Oh. I think I can handle that. Uh, where are these people that are hanging out here, though? Oh, there's one hiding. So now not only do I have to worry about friends hiding on me, now I have to find some slumbering initiates that are lazy. <clears throat> I mean, so uh, how, how do we stop you from blushing, but further the erection? How do we get to that point, my friends? What do I need to do?
uh, friction. I think that's what works uh, so well for most people. When do I get a mount? I, this is already getting a little like, I, how long do I have to move like a slow ass like this? First mount's tied to story. Motherfucker. You're gonna build a home right here by these bog yarsons? I should be okay at level four to level seven, trying to murder these people. Nominate Alan Wake 2 for game of the year. We'll do the trick. Oh, okay. I assume you've played it then. God, I wasn't expecting them to come all the way up here. Don't hit me! Just go up to these people and say, Don't eat me! And they won't eat you. You have indeed, and it was great. Played on PC or, uh... I heard it, I heard it, it ran relatively well on pretty much everything, so... Oh, I gotta get my feet wet on this. How dare I. Riveting. Fuck you, bog man. Oh. All right, now I gotta find uh, where this other, you know, this other schleb is hanging out. <clears throat> there he is. Perfect. PC had to suck up pride against Epic Game Store, but wait, it's not on Steam. So, a uh, cat is is Fire Emblem Engage? Is that the second? Fire Emblem, or is the Engage one that's like the Dynasty Warriors game? Because I know they've made one of those as well. Not for a while, no. Okay. Can you not see I'm attempting to become one with nature? Leave me be, good sir. Oh, sorry, yep. With toothpaste man or woman? Who's, wait, what? What type of toothpaste people we chatting about here? Shout with this wonderful person. Apparently, I have Amazon at the door, so. My 18-inch penis attachment has come in. <clears throat> uh, have I come to train? I, I I don't know. Have I? So you've turned orange and black as well. Then wait, what happened? Is my color off again? Are you winning? I'm trying, Misty. I'm trying. <clears throat> well, are you happy with these shells that we got? I can tell, ooh, woo, woo. This is Halloween, I mean, look, look, okay, look. I'm getting sunlight from over here, even though the blind, like, look, okay? I'm a vampire, I don't like natural light. Um, And uh, and then my light from here, and you know, I put a hand there, and then it blocks, and then it adjusts. I'm not as orange as you think I am, okay? And they're using big words like carapaces and drills, and whatnot. But I will, uh, do I want the food at this point? Orange, you glad to see me? <laughs> uh, oh, cool, Canada got the sun update as well. Yeah, we did, we did. <clears throat> I just take the, do the what? The dosh? The what? You mean, you mean the, you mean the mutt? What did you mean? But what is the dosh? Dosh? Is that a is that a is that a term for money I'm unaware of? Yeah, take the money. 
Doge? Oh, I don't believe your your fucking American slang anymore. I'm done. Okay, you're gonna start having to talk in in British terms. Okay, I can't do it anymore. I can't and I won't. Slag. Yeah, th that's how we keep Baker around here is with the shitty jokes. Okay, that's how it is. It came from a game called Killing Floor, which was based on British characters. For fuck. Baker, couldn't you at least help me out there? Like, could have sent me, like, a private message and said, Jordan, you're a fucking idiot. Dosh is British slang, but we're gonna help you out here. No, you couldn't. I thought it was quid. I thought, I thought dollar a do. That's Australian. And then I thought quid or squid. Whatever. I think it's squid. Squid? Quid. Da ah is no. Da ah da asha da ah da ah is not not da oh squid is all okay we'll get there <clears throat> little o not big o what what do you mean little o and not big o fuck's the difference whether it's a little o or a big o it still makes the sound o like. Oh. Gosh. Look. I think you guys are making fun of me again. When I'm reading words. And I think you all got fucking together in Discord before this happened and said, like, look, what can we come up with some other fucking fake name for money? And we're all like, oh, we got to make it simple, right? He's not that stupid. And it's like, I don't know. How about we just try a dosh or something, right? Like, I'll see if it works. And it did, and it's embarrassing. Now, so how can something that's spelled Dosh be Dutch? The O sound like the O in on. on? What? But what if I say own? Right? Like, what if I say that? Not the O in own. 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 All right. That's that's enough. What is this guy? What is this guy's name? Two sub cameras up. Fucking, I think just Chris Kringle just fucking went by and you know slathered our presence with a bunch of snowmen. That's great, right? Thank you. <clears throat> and they also own a small dog. Did you always play as a as a? What what are you? What are you, Wolf Slayer? You actually have something to give me, and I thought it'd be funny. Well, I always like funny things, but I can I can I pet your dog? My fat cat is bigger than your dog. Blood curd. Why are you giving me one hundred raspberries? What do they do? Oh. Experience bonuses for 30 minutes. Well, that's okay. Thank you. Yes, complete the trade. Thank you, sir. Yeah, so what are you? You're 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 a hot lady. <clears throat> you have no cat ears. Are you just a human? You're an you're an Oora. Um lizard people. Oh, like the queen. Okay. Shouldn't she be all like scaly? And whatnot? Maybe not. Where is this guy? So, every, wait, is everyone is wait no? Population wave. Oh, I, okay. So we're just returning to the the archer world. Okay. Uh there do be scales if you look closely. I can't. God damn it! Get get really. Is that a, is that a scale or are you happy to see me? Oh, not on the neck. No. Oh. I don't know, but you have like a COVID mask on or something. Oh, you have horns. God. Okay. Oh, I'm okay. 
We're going away now. We're going away. Get, get away from the fire. Ridiculous. We're screenshotting things. Getting me in trouble. <clears throat> oh, give me a break. There's people who are sitting in a fucking blow up hot tub in their fucking bedroom with nothing but, you know, tape over their nipples. And yet I do that and I get banned. Good to see you, Baker. It really is. You too could be a hot tub. I could be. <clears throat> How the fuck did you beat me in here? Well, I guess I didn't see you ahead of me, so you already walked ahead. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. <clears throat> oh, we can do the main story quest too. That's great. Um, a child just walked by my computer, saw that, and his head exploded. Oh, you have a mount. See you in court, buddy. How have you been, Baker? Are you ready for the holidays? So eat these berries before a dungeon. Do I want to be eating these berries now? Like, while leveling up? We're already level five. I mean, we're well on our way to level 90. Well, well, the fledgling adventure returns and none the worse for wear by the look of it. You may be yet of use for this nation. This guy right here, this is the baker of, of the arching guild. I've been being, things are slowly getting back to usual. Well, that's good. Things being back to usual for baker means we get to see more of baker. I don't know that the experience increase applies to quest rewards, which is where most of your non dungeon experience comes from. Oh, I, I should have. Are you telling me I should have read more about the, uh... Ooh! Oh! I guess I want me an eye patch then, eh? Or mateys! I come for the seeds. I mean, that's quite the upgrade right there. Probably good to have armor. Yeah, I can't just be stumbling around in my cat stuff all day. Good call. Recommended here. Give me the eye patch and the ring of fidelity. Whatever the hell that does. Work. Uh, look, I didn't mean to. I wanted to scroll. I wanted to scroll in to see the eye patch, and it wouldn't let me move. Look, it won't let me move. Oh, might as well get that in there. Okay. Motherfucker. Uh, I'm not a fan of the of the headgear stuff, so I'm just going to turn that off. But uh, <clears throat> unless I'm given a really nice hat. Ah, uh, you know what? For now, it's just a, a, an eye patch. We'll rock it for now. Right click and drag. Oh. Oh. Uh, you know, I used the same excuse when I was stood over a dead body holding a bloody knife. A bloody knife! Oi! All right, that's, that's, good. that's a good conversation. Okay, good, good talk. Good talk. You've already started decorating for Christmas. Who else has their, their lights and or tree up currently? We have uh, successfully completed the trial. Yes, of course we have. And we've proven ourselves worthy of these halls, of this... Uh, you know, I feel like many injuries must happen here. Like, I assume like walking over there is like a no-go. Way too early? Now, I guess the follow-up question is, uh, do you buy a real tree or 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 a fake tree? <sighs> December 1st, okay. 
Now, you may be a member of the Archer's Guild. Know that your seniors will not coddle you with personal attention. It's up to you to seek out the experiences you need to grow as a Farcher. And to the end, I present to you the Hunting Log. Written within are the names of such creatures who would provide a fitting challenge. Should you find yourself lacking direction, you would do well to refer to the log. By way of the first step, I encourage you to practice proper technique, loose arrow after arrow, and pay close attention to form until the movement becomes second nature. More papyra. Oh, that is. I had a real tree once, never again. I always heard that, like, um... <clears throat> Now, we, we've put our tree up. We haven't decorated it yet. My wife did the, the balcony lights. Um, but uh, the uh, my wife was always worried about the cats getting into the tree. So we waited until this year to get a, uh, a new tree because we were worried about Charlie. I shouldn't say I wasn't worried about Charlie. Like, the cat's a cat. The cat's going to do cat things. Um, but I just assume that if you have a real tree, it's, it's just like, uh, you know, like every single... Uh, you know, Christmas vacation. You know, the dog is gonna want into the the the, the tree water and and get in on it. Get a fake one, reuse it the next year. No messy. Right, exactly. <clears throat> See, but like DJ, the Canadians have already celebrated our Thanksgiving. So feel free to put up your outdoor lights. See, the problem is here it gets too fucking cold. Like you wait longer to put stuff out. Like it's, it's a little it's a little too long in the tooth. Well, let's see, Lucian. Uh, you had me murder toadstools, fungars, ladybugs. I think I'm a master of my domain of the bow. You used to have a real tree growing up each year. There was such a big mess. Yeah, like those pine needles, I'm sure, are, are a pain in the ass. <laughs> well, and an archer must remain vigilant. Yes. We're always going to be just sitting in the back, just blowing loads everywhere. That's All right. Well, you want me to hit some hidden targets throughout the city? Seek out and destroy them. I think I can do that with my heavy shot technique. Dropping the heavy loads is one thing. All right, so let's see. Uh, I tart red berry found growing throughout the black shroud. Experience bonus is 3% duration. Um... Uh, doesn't say anything else beyond, you know, what it's during. Like, so, I would assume it could be, you know, for when we're out fighting things. All right. Where are, the, where are these? There's, the, there's an archery, but... Where is another butt? I think I'm missing a butt around here. But you still play this Baker? I know. Uh, I know. Briefly, you were uh, in on this as well. Played in ages, just like myself. <clears throat> All right. So we're gonna go and report to them, and they're probably not. Well, no, that was a level five request, so we're gonna have to probably we'll go here. We'll get the new main story quest. We'll probably go back for a new expansion. Don't know. That's what most people do with uh, <clears throat> with MMOs. You know, wait for the, the nice new content to come out and get in on it. <gasps> we might get legs. Have I visited the Bannock on my wanderings? What the fuck is the Bannock? Training gown. Just uh, found out a training gown. Uh, 
Training ground found just outside the city where the soldiers of the Order of the Twin Adder drilled in the swordplay and other martial mathers. Isn't that Eminem? A gentleman by the name of Galfrey, instructor there, and might get some use out of him. Go and introduce yourself and find out if there's anything you can do to help. Mind you, don't stray far from the path. The Welveswood is no place for merry strolls through the underbrush. All right. Um, what is go to the... No, I don't want to go there. How come I can't teleport? Oh, I can't tell... Can I not teleport? Have I not learned teleport yet? Are you kidding me? How the fuck do I learn that? Yeah, a lot of people are very excited about uh, the new stuff with, uh, with WoW. Um, you know, they basically came out and said, like, here's our next three expansions, which I've heard a few people think that that means, like, set out, like, the next six years and I think they're going to make WoW 2 I, I think I don't know if that's death for them or not I mean now they're part of Microsoft so it's sort of irrelevant they probably don't care but they, I, I feel like they can't really do a redo of everything like they need to make a, a proper new game maybe a new, new engine you know start over alright you want me to travel to the North Shroud and put down eight micro chews and eight opo popos. What? Why am I fucking up the wildlife in this game? <clears throat> Xbox and Microsoft are planning to make Blizzard independent from Activision, which is great. Yes, yes. That'd be great to see. Sort of like uh, how, like I guess, like Bungie is separate from uh, Sony, but not really separate like you know as long as they don't fuck around and find out you know things will still be okay but you know mommy and daddy will still be watching yeah I'm, I'm sure that whole thing with bobby Kodak just sticking around is just uh you know dotting the t's crossing the i's fucking reverse that crossing t's dotting i's there we go Embarrassing listening to me talk every once in a while. Do you think he goes and starts a new company with all of the, the bajillions he will have? Or does he just go off into the sunset and just, you know, buy an island? Seems like there's potential there, which we need. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so now we got our hunting log, guys. Perfect. <clears throat> so we can fuck up their days. Get some experience rather easily here. It's out of here. He could probably retire, but chances are he'll be scoped up by another corporate and work until he's pushed off the board. Yeah, you're probably not wrong. All right, so I had a particular way that I like this. Venomous Bite, that's a dot. Heavy shots are everyday shots. Straight shot, and then a leg graze, eh? <clears throat> yeah, how old is he? He's got to be like late 50s, early 60s would be my guess. I'm going to get lost in this hunting log. like and don't retire when they get and get more money for their golf but like I, I guess this is the thing i never understand about you know the, the super rich elite people like don't don't they have enough money like i mean it's you know the amount of money that he has is is that not enough at that point i guess the answer is always like no that it's never enough for them right but it's just always like it's got to be a point right like I don't think he's a billionaire, but if he is, he's probably pretty goddamn close. Damn. 
That was the laugh that we all loved. Let's do a fate. Let's get that out. Oh, we only got two minutes to do it. We're not going to get that one done. Oh, Baker, this is why I missed you, bud. The, it's, uh, you know, I, I can always make you laugh, right? Greetings, Bastion Omega. Me own sent word to expect you. My name is Galfred, and I'm responsible for training our Twin Adder recruits. I thank you for volunteering for your assistance. The Twelve's Woods has much changed since the calamitous arrival of the Seventh Umbral Era five eras ago. Uh, there's a saying I'll always remember, they don't want some of the money, they want all of it. Yeah. The power of the elemental wanes, and the harmony of the Force gives way to chaos. The great abundance of life has been lost as the strong run rampant, stifling the weak and new sprung. And though it may not appear so to the eyes of an outsider, the Twelve's Wood is ailing. It's once rich variety of fading memory. For the citizens of Gridania, the restoration of the Force is a sacred duty. And it is hope that adventurers such as you will offer to aid them in their struggle. Listen to their requests and do all that you can. And may the Elementals bless your endeavors. Alright, we're going to get ourselves some boots. He's got a new quest. You can win capitalism by having more zeros in your bank account than everyone else. Yeah, I guess. All right. He wants us to inspect equipment. Oh, I think this is... Uh... Yeah, we're level 7. He's going to want us to have a certain level of equipment. And we're not there yet. But we'll get there. Get yourself some proper gear, Jordan. Oh, I already have it. Well, look at that. Hey, Jordan wins. Right? I love the recommended you know, gear button, right? It's just wonderful. You know, you throw on the shit. There you go. You're good. Oh, ready for inspection? Yo. Yes, there. Oswald, back straight. Hi, Tulip Hoptart. You are a hottie. It's probably a man playing as a as a bunny, but nevertheless, you'd be surprised, that, you know, because because Coromaro, Lady Reptile. You gotta be careful. I stared at his butt. I mean, he's swoony. He's got a butt, but, you know. All right. Um, are we ready to go? What are you handing me now? Ooh, maple shortbow from Canada. I'll grab that. Doesn't appreciate new weapons. It is 90% likely to be a man. <laughs> All right, what do you got for me now, Galfred? More help, eh? You need me to investigate suspicious activity in the Twelves Wood. Well, I got to worry about slaying Opo Opos and Micro Chews. So when does that happen? Oh, like a cutscene? My God. Good. Time is of the essence, so listen well. You will have now heard of a suspicious individual that has been seen prowling the Twelves Wood. And you might be aware of the Ixali activity has risen sharply in the region. But what we do know is that it may have coincided exactly with the first recorded sighting of the aforementioned individual. Are you telling me that they may be connected? Tightened up surveillance in hopes of tracking down the unknown visitor. But warnings of exceedingly elusive. But where a whole units have failed, a lone adventurer may succeed, and I think this is where I might come in. For the sake, I ask you that you aid us in this investigation. Well, by God, I'm a pirate, and I'm not even at Limsa Lominsa. But I'm going to help you solve this mystery, Galfred. And I'm going to go uh, search on over this stump of a penis and see where these sightings have taken place. But I'm doing this by myself? How about before I go over to that? I'm going to go and uh, deal with these uh, matter of perspective. These, where? They said like New North Shroud. I got to go to a completely new area? Have we even been to Bent Branch? We haven't even been to Bent Branch Meadow. Okay, let's go get that attunement done. 
and then we can go and get this. I'll never forget the gate. I played WoW when I was younger and got scanned by a Blood Elf female who's really a dude. <clears throat> my entire bank got emptied, but goddamn, it was worth it for the dance they gave me while I was laying down at an inn. Oh my god. I, 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 well, I mean. Hey, when was the last time you played WoW, Baker? Like, I know, like, you know, we just discussed they're, they're doing wonderful things, you know. I, I, I just don't think it's something like I want to get into again. Even though I just came off it. It's weird because the wife likes WoW. Like, she prefers that to Final Fantasy, whereas I prefer Final Fantasy to WoW. But, you know, you know, an MMO is a, is a social game, right? So, you know, you, you like to have friends to play with, which you know, makes it more fun, obviously. By during Shadowlands, I, I I I dabbed in Shadowlands very briefly. Didn't even hit like you know the the level cap. Just the one thing that bothers me about World of Warcraft and that this game does right, and and it's not just one little thing. And and, and I'm a story guy, very much a story guy. I hadn't played World of Warcraft like I just. I, I, I bought Dragonflight and, and, and played it for maybe a couple months type of thing. Get, you know, wet the appetite, as they would say. But I'm always like a person, like, I have to start over, much like how we just did here. I, I can't just jump into my, my main and, 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 and play. I'm not like that. And the thing that bothered me, and WoW is always doing this, is... They were trying to get me through the content to get to the new content. But all I wanted to do was just enjoy the current content I was in. And I couldn't do it. Like, they were rushing me, rushing me through everything. Like, you know, I start at the beginning, I pick my 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 scenario I want to play in, you know, which is also confusing. Um I, I couldn't just like, you know, I I couldn't just pick level one and go. Look, I want to start here, and I want to play, and and just go, and and you know, and, you know, no, it, there, there wasn't a way. It's like, no, we're gonna throw forty percent experience bonuses at you, and and you're not even gonna see all of the world. And the second you hit, you know, level sixty or seventy, we're we're gonna shove you to the new place because that's where we think you want to go. And I and I sort of wish is like, I wish they took the approach of like, no, let me, if I want to do the new stuff, I'll do the new stuff. Like, don't. Don't shove it down my throat. I'll get there when I get there type of thing. It bothered me. Yes, the the, the levels have always been stupid. I I don't... I mean, how many level squishes has WoW done? I think three? Three or four? Like, I don't think they know what to do. Um, Like, which is why I thought of, like... My guess is I, I think they just realized, like, shit, we just have to do a... Uh, We just have to start a new game. They only did one squish? I just sworn that I, I I can at least remember two. Cause like there was one when I just played Dragon Dragon whatever. Uh and I remember there was one shortly after Cataclysm or something. <clears throat> WoW does a lot of things right. Like, I mean, you know, the game's been around a lot longer than Final Fantasy. They do do like I still feel like Final Fantasy doesn't feel like I want it to feel like World of Warcraft does. But, you know, then you go and play World of Warcraft and you realize like, oh, like I miss my friends in the community from Final Fantasy because they're not all fucking toxic pieces of shit. Um, no, really? Interesting. Well, shows what I remember. I, I want to say like, can I? I don't know if I can go through that gate. I remembered like there was a gate where they stop you, but I don't know if it was that gate or, or maybe it was that gate. Fourteen has a different kind of toxic. I wouldn't say it's less toxic. It's uh. Oh, yeah, these are fucking level 29s. I don't want to be bothering with these things. 
They're gonna light me up like a Christmas tree. I'm level fucking seven. What am I doing here? Um, I in all my in all my time I've played Final Fantasy 14, and again I haven't really played end game content or anything like that. And 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 truly at the same time is is when I played end game content in WoW. That's where the toxicity really does show. Um, but it's always felt welcoming. Uh, Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, people are far more willing to help. Uh, I, I remember running lower level dungeons when I was getting back into WoW. And nobody was really, you know, interested in, you know, helping. Everyone's just in a hurry, hurry, hurry. Whereas in this game, I find people are willing to help new people. Yeah, like, like you fuck up in a dungeon in World of Warcraft, everyone is leaving you, right? Like everyone's like, well, I'm not interested, right? Whereas in, in Final Fantasy, like, no, like let's, Let's try to get to the, the bottom of this and, and fix that, right? Like, they're willing to help. Now, of course, you can only do so much. Um, you know, if you're going to be an absolute dumbo, then, you know, they, they can only help you so much, but. All right, so, yeah, this, so, yeah, this yellow serpent gate, I'm not sure if I can go through it or not. We're going to find out. I would love to kill these things for that quest. Yeah, and and again, like I I I'm going to really honestly try my darndest to really get through this 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 story because i've heard nothing but great things about about this game so i really want to try my my darndest to to get through it properly you know and i got i got people willing to, to lend a helping hand and you know we, we can go from there lots of quests another area i can see if we can get there but i think that's going to be a tough area we'll just nail these Jordan's going to make the level 30 this time. Maybe. Maybe. No, I I, I honestly I, I want to I want to get some things done. Honestly. Like we'll, we'll start with a realm we're born, obviously, but I mean I, I want to honestly do it. But uh, you know, at the same time, I'm 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 realistic to know, like, I know not, this isn't everybody's jam, and, and I know people come to watch me play other games, Cold Steel and whatnot. We're going to start Final Fantasy VIII uh, this week as well. Um, and so, you know, my, my goal is just to play this once a week and, and see where it takes us. You know, I, I think that's going to be enough for on stream to whet the appetite for people. I, I can do the side quests off, off stream and, 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 and we can go from there. How do I get a mount? Was it 20? Where's he? Who's a five, Jordan? Oh, fuck. I mean, how is this thing not dying? It's, it's, it's coming. It's on the list, Baker. It's on the list. The list gets bigger every goddamn day. But uh, I, I, I will finish the Yakuza series. Yeah, so I'm on five, you know, of, of eight. That's not bad for, for Jordan, right? Not bad, all things considered. Got lots of Final Fantasies to play. 
some dragon quests for play. Yeah, DJ's playing Yakuza 2, I believe. God damn it, didn't need to kill this thing. Now I'm, now I'm murdering one of these monkeys for no apparent reason. Damn. I always just have to assume that there's somewhere, somewhere along the lines, Koro or uh, Rowan upstream is, is, is behind me, following me. Somewhere. Kawami 2. Okay. Kawami 2. I remember those. I think I played... What? So I played... Uh... No, Kawam... Kawami 1 and 2 are the remakes of 1 and 2, right? Because there was Yakuza 0, and then there was Kawami 1 and 2, and then 3, 4, 5. Okay. I think that's... I think if I remember correctly. I also need to play Judgment 1 and 2, Like a Dragon, Ishin, Like a Dragon, The Man Who Erased them. Yeah, there's, there's lots of, lots of things. Stay away from the giant tree, he'll fuck your day up. And I had to fight every urge, seriously, even though I, I, I didn't really want to be one, but... Every once in a while, I still take a look at a Lala Fell, and I'm like, yeah, I could have been a Lala Fell. Really could have been a Lala Fell. Still might. Never know. But in the end, I'm always a cat person. Who do we think is in the mask? Is there any absolute chance that it possibly could be CM Punk? And they are, they're all playing the, the most wonderful... Wonderful game on us. Please don't tell me it's Jack Perry. Because nobody's gonna care. Maybe it'll be QT Marshall. All right, where am I going? I got I got a couple of things done. We got to do the stump. We're level eight. We'll probably level up seven. Like I said, I was going to do side quests for my own time so that I have stuff to do when I want to play. I got to pay money to fucking teleport? God damn it. I don't have any money. Remember when I thought that guy was going to die, Baker, and you had me set? You, you, you know, I was basically in tears. Could be Adam Cole, baby. Could be. Majima would wear a mask if it meant that he would lead to a fight with Kurt. Yes. <clears throat> I really wish, like, I really sucked at those games, and I don't know what, what difficulty you're playing on, DJ, but, like, I got mad and I was playing on dad mode. Like, I just got so mad a lot of times at that game. Like, it was fear infuriating. <clears throat> oh, I feel like they have a fucking pay-per-view every fucking week. Playing normal. You don't find it uh, too bad? I mean, I'm an idiot, like I said. So. They did. They did. <clears throat> that was the easier way there. <clears throat> Fuck! That's the one that they won't let you go past until you're like level fucking 30 or something. It's not too bad. Maybe I'm just an idiot. Like, legit. Like, incapable. 
They need to go up to like uh, like a dragon zone. That's their main. Yes, yes. I, I mean, I've always had that thought of like I, I want to play that one just because, you know. I wasn't a fan. Like I like the story of the Yakuza games, but I don't like the battle system. Like I don't I don't want an action game. That's not what I want. But you know, if I want to know the story in order to get to the Japanese RPG one, where where you know it's like very Persona esque. Um, you know. That's where we'll get. Where is this fucking stump? No. Very reminiscent of DQ11, but without a crack, and that'll make... Oh, fuck. Don't even remind me. I, I still want to go back and start that over again. But I have the ever, ever loving fear that I'm going to get to that Kraken and fail again. And I and I don't know if I can take that that level of failure again. You know what I'm saying? I don't. I don't. I don't think I can. I don't think I can deal with it. Eight maybe here. <clears throat> there we go. Someone tell me these things are anuses, right? I don't. I, I. I. don't know what I did wrong. Like I honestly couldn't tell you. Like I, I, unless we go back to that game and do it again, I, I honestly couldn't tell you what on earth I did wrong on that fight. Whether I leveled Eric wrong or something, I don't know. I don't know. And, and and now like it's been so long like I have it on the PlayStation but I don't have the S version so like I'm at the point where I was like I probably just might as well buy it on Steam so I have it on Steam and can play it on you know the S version or something Let's just bring out my inner Rob Schneider for me there uh Baker, you know, you can do it. Oh, God, I gotta go the other way. What do you got left on this hunting log? Three more. Yes, DQ12 will be out by then, and I'll probably want to play that. And DQ12, isn't that the one that they're like going a different route with or something? But they're not like not a lot is no oh my god the Harlem Shake people. Do it whatever to be honest, DQ12 is a long way away because they're having to redo large wait, why are they having to redo it? Is did, did it not go over the way they wanted it to or what? We're about to enter an instance battle. Okay, I can do that. Special instances. Yes, level effect and whatnot. Here, level nine. Turns out trying to make DQ more adult is too hard. So are they going back to make it more kitty, or are they just like they have to like really try hard? I feel I always felt like, you know, because they're both the same company now. Someone's already here. Um, I feel like the problem is like always felt Final Fantasy was the adult based game and DQ was the other one. Oh dear, is that a sword in the stump? Bad idea. Really bad idea. It takes a lot less than that to incite the green wrath, you know? Why, the first time we came to the Twelves Wood, Is we this almost our ended dark up as a stranger? Dinner, just for crashing our airship in the wrong place. No, no, no! It was this all Papa Limo's fault, close. of course. Though, he'd sooner swallow his staff. Hmm. You know him, Kublo Cop? Yeah, I ran into him. He drank the booze. But we did once share a carriage. Isn't that right? Our first real story stuff. How are the readings? 
Yeah, like, did that Save fuck up? The last. There is a disturbance here as well. And I feel like, why were they all talking at once? It felt like the, the girl was talking. Kuplo Cop seems convinced um, of your innocence. But if this isn't your doing, who's It felt like the girl was talking and the the this little guy was talking to the 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 moog okay, yes, yes. I, I was thinking that way. Like she was just carrying on going ba 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 ba. And, uh, and then he was carrying on. Okay, makes sense. Thank you. Thank you, Miss Biscuits. Ever since the calamity, the forest's been really sensitive. <laughs> the slightest disruption to the etheric flow... And this sort of thing happens. Shots fired, big Shots fired. Now you gotta fuck up a tree. Several trees. I think I'm a pirate. It seems we have little choice. So what is she, a pugilist? A pugilist? He's a thaumatage. Oh, okay. Why am I even here when you can just take it out with one swift move of your ice moves? Should have been a black mage. Oh, they're blank shots, just like other things in my life. Wait, oh my. You shoot blanks out of there, uh, Baker? What's wrong with that, buddy? They're infamous for difficult rotations that change constantly. I did dab. In, 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 in one on my main briefly for a hot second. And the only thing I remember is like, you have to keep switching. I didn't find it overly complicated, shockingly maybe. Um, but all I remember is like, you know, you'd, you'd use fire like three times and then you had to use something else to um, reset your MP. Like maybe it gets uh, tough in the, uh, in a dungeon or something, but I didn't find it overly bad. Oh, it's very different at 60, 70. Well, we're only going to stop playing at level 30, so we have nothing to worry about there. Uh, with... But see, that's another thing, too, that, that I could argue, like, is the same about World of Warcraft. You're stuck playing something, and you learn a certain way, and then out of nowhere, they decide to change it up near end game for whatever reason. Like, you learn to play as something for 50 levels, and then out of nowhere, you're you're, you're gonna change the way they do it? Like, I, I, I'm not the biggest fan of that. I mean, I, I, I do like the option that, you know what, hey, if I wanna try Black Mage, I can try it, and if I don't like it and it doesn't work out, oh well, I just don't do it again. I, I stick with Bard or, or whatever it is, right? Whatever I like, I can be anything I want. I wanna be a Red Mage, Maybe I won't like it. I don't know, but um, you never know. I guess it's to keep things fresh. It's the introduction of new mechanics within the class, new gauges, skills. See, as long as it's not like I have to hit a thousand fucking buttons, I'm okay with that. So we might give it a whirl. Might give it a whirl. It is, it is. You're, you're very right, Baker. It's a huge problem in MMOs. Oh my God, Viagra. Wolf Slayer, did you drop this, or...? You have gifts for me. Well, thank you. I mean, 
if you haven't noticed, folks, that's one of those bigger Viagras. Uh, that's not one that you uh, consume orally. Uh, this is one that you shove right up your bum. And it works like that. Nope, they don't. They do not, Baker. You are very right. And they, and, and as you can tell, yeah. They're making everyone, oh, everyone can be a druid. Everyone can be a paladin. Every, like, they're, they're, they're playing it because people are complaining, like, oh, I want to be a fucking this, and, and I, I, but I can't be that. Like, no, it, it, it sh they should go back to the, like, no, only certain things can do certain things. Not, not everyone can be everything. Exactly. Although, mind you, then you go the other end of the spectrum. Although I think it fits in this game. But, you know, this game doesn't make you make multiple characters. This guy right here, he can be everything. Right? No, I'm floating I through space. Am All made one. So the crystals can talk now? A light there once was that shone throughout this realm, yet it has since grown dim. And as it hath faltered, yes, they do. so hath darkness yes, they do. up in its stead, presaging an end to life. For the sake of all... Did you see, Baker? I, I, not that I have chosen to do so, I've only done it once. <laughs> But uh, I can I can I can restream again if I'd like. <laughs> the power to banish the dark. I can go back to streaming on Mixer, YouTube, and Mixer. Of light, journey forth and lay claim to them. Yes, it's it's an MMO, but barely. Yeah, like exactly. You're right. It 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 it's basically you know people can play this game solo. But that's also why it's enjoyable as as an MMO a little bit. Yes, Wolfslayer, you, you said it perfectly. By thy deeds. But I think it's the right approach to an MMO. Like, it, you know, as much as you can do everything by yourself, it's fun to do things with more people. Should I be paying attention to this? Crystal talking to me? Who is that? That just like another another person playing me. Oh Jesus Christ, watch out. Just got taken out by a, a large man. Okay. But that's good because as someone who came from playing World of Warcraft recently and wanting to do old dungeons, if, if the rest of the population are not playing that particular scenario, no one's queuing up. And I've always said, Final Fantasy does it right because you get higher level people doing lower level dungeon roulettes because they get something out of it, right? Like give them... give. Give the people a higher level a reason to play the lower level stuff with new people. And WoW doesn't do that. I don't know why they haven't figured that out yet. Probably because they're idiots. <clears throat> Our culprit, it would seem, an Ixel. And no ordinary Ixel either. A chieftain. But but, but my problem is, they would Baker, they've taken too long. Enemy territory. Like, the they've known that's been a problem for a long time. People have been orders. screaming to them that that's been a problem for a long time, and they just chose to ignore it. And now they realize, like, oh, shit, this is costing this is us money. Emo. We need we to fix this. Out. It's too late. It was an it's yes. too late. Good. Yes, we'll seek Brother Esumian's cooperation in the matter. Ida? Giant crystals? Oh, loud. Can't say I... The two of these people just don't shut up, do they? Sure you're feeling better? Understood. Over and out. Kuplo Cop, please bear word of these developments to Brother Esumian. We shall soon return to give a full report. 
Understood. Over and out. Kaboom! <clears throat> uh, Wolf Slayer, if you don't mind me asking uh, if Miss Biscuits is still here, I would assume so. Maybe she's lurking. And anything anything on her Is job front? Uh, you know, Till next time. Looking, looking on the care. good side of things or anything. I mean, I know she's still doing that other job, right? But I know she was still looking for that that one job that she really wanted. You know, I just I feel like I should always ask. It might be a clue. You should definitely pull it out and take it back to the. We're we gonna pull out this master sword or what? Is this uh? Is this our new girlfriend? Or is she like involved with? You don't suppose that with a small could see child, Pocop, do you? And this occurs to you now? Yes, it waiting. seemed that way. Okay, time yeah, it is just what it is, right? Government dragging their 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 government feet. Well, time will have to because you won't. You never tell me what's really going on, unless. <gasps> You don't know this what's going on. a long ass cutscene. Poor Wolf Slayer's just waiting out there, waiting to give me stuff. Well, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Ms. Biscuits. No, I, 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 I can, I can just send nothing but the, the best of vibes to you. Free companies. Who the fuck is inviting me to free companies? Except murder and Pendragon's free company invite. What the? Halo? What is wrong with you people? Just blindly throwing out things. No, thank you. I let that go away. <clears throat> Take this magic blade. I am going to join one, but I'm going to join uh, Mr. and Mrs. Biscuits one. Mrs. Biscuits and I are part of an FC that we recommend you, like, coming to you. Oh, wait, you want me, you want me to stay here? Just, just sit sexually by the uh, the waterfall for you? Your half brother's having to find new work since his company he works for is going under. That that is shitty. Or we can meet in in the city. In the city. All right, I need to go pee first, so I'll wait on you coming. Give me a sec. Thank you. 
Thank you. Oh, look at that. Oh my God, there's a, there's a man dancing in front of me. That's great. Worked for Czech company and Czechs are kind of being made redundant. Jordan's gone. I can hear the voices again. Yeah, it's just, you know, it's, it's, join, I, I, sure, I would love to join your party. Do I, is this, do, am I, do I also start to dance? Hold on, let me, let me slash dance. Is that a thing I can do? I dance happily. I'm not dancing happily. Though. There we go. What a shitty dance that is. Misclick, sorry. You, so you didn't want to be, fine, you know what, fine, you know what, fine, fine, fine. Leave your party. Unable to leave party. God damn it. Oh, what are you sending me? Goat skin. Level 20? I'm level 9. These are all wonderful things, though. Um, how many goats did you have to murder for me to have this? Thank you, sir. Nine goats. And they're high quality. Oh, you have more things. God damn it, it never ends. Thank you, kind sir. Oh, oh, okay. What, what are you doing? What, what is that dance? Like, there's a name for that, right? A full gear set of eleven items. So for, for so for at level twenty, I am I am set, right? Did you all make it one 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 color? Okay. Now can I leave this terrible party of this dancing person? Oh, God. Let them be. Just let them be. Thank you, sir. And off I go. Uh, where are we heading? We are going out to the Bannock, and then we're going to go to New Gridania. Do I want to keep beating these fun guys? I mean, we could, right? Why not? Free, free. What are you doing, Ren? You murdering everything? Okay, I'm, 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 I'm hitting things with, with my, with my archer girlfriend. <clears throat> uh, you're very welcome. I'll make you more over time. As yeah, and I feel like you don't I probably have to overdo it with the uh, with the high quality stuff. But maybe it doesn't cost you anything. I don't know. I I, I never got into the crafting game, so maybe it's you know you know the the goats that you have to murder for it are you know are irrelevant. Mrs. P, Jordan's got an archer girlfriend. Say, thank God she's at work. Which is terrible currently. Uh, not not the work part. But uh, in our fucking city, sorry. In Hamilton, Ontario, Canada. Um, the, uh, the buses have gone on strike. And my wife doesn't have her driver's license. So... So she's she's expecting me to take her to work every day. Like what the fuck? <laughs> hey, I'm back. Yeah, one of your patrols that has been spotted doing battle enraged treants. Is, are those the trees? Um, I did go over to the, the the stump, and I met some of your friends. There's a skill I can use that literally makes it HQ with a single click. Oh. Well, that, and I'm sure it's low leveled stuff too, right? What, did I? Did I pee on myself? Anyways, 
Um. There I am talking out loud again. <laughs> Uh, so, well, yeah, we got acquainted with uh, Aida and Papi Lamo. Um, they're our staunchest of allies. Anything level 80 and below, I can do high quality with no effort. And crafted gear is generally only worth it if it's HQ. High quality. All right. Oh, well, they assist at the God's Quiver and with the Wood... So, is this... Sorry. Is this guy a Wood Whaler? Poppy Lim Limoe? Pop Pop Poppy Limo. Poppy Li did I say his name wrong? We already know that we already know that I did. <clears throat> Alright. Well, anyways, yeah, there we go. Well, I, I mean, that's how I said it. That's how it's pronounced, Ms. Biscuits. That's how it's pronounced. Eggs over queasy! <laughs> ah, the jokes write themselves. Uh, they want us to uh, collect some Chigo egg sacs. That sounds wonderful. Chigo. Did I say that wrong too? Chigo? Chigoes. Chigoes. There we go. We'll get there. <clears throat> Candle of rooms. Everything just becomes a fucking full circle here, folks. How do you say that properly again? Candle broom, right? I feel like that's not the right way. Analyst, yes, we, we know that one. Uh, I think it's candle broom or something. We'll get there. All right. Oh, at least these things are nearby. No new gear. Until level 20 and then and then I murder everybody. <clears throat> can can do la brum. Can do la brum. Can do la brum. All right, we'll get there. Just I'm just gonna stop talking. Insanity. Say it like this, cha. <laughs> You're not wrong, cha. Uh, uh. But I was young when I played Metal Gear Solid. Okay, and I am from Canada, and we really don't have a military. Our military is the United States military. So I never knew what a Chaff grenade was, or a cha uh, uh Okay, we don't know what these are. Okay, so just fucking relax. I think uh, I think Canada as a country. I think we just bought like thirty-five airplanes, and everyone's going crazy because they cost like a hundred billion dollars. You must be the adventurer staying in for our injured companions. Terrible, unfortunate business. I, yes. Would you like these egg sacks? I don't know what they're going to do for you, but... Uh, you think they put them on their penis and then that makes it okay? Like, you know, like... Do the egg sacks get put on an erect penis after four hours? And, and then that makes it go away? You're not wrong, Baker. You're not wrong. That's why the that's why everyone's going crazy. Is is because we only own like six airplanes and we decided to buy 35 brand new ones like F-35s. Like we probably don't even have we don't even have probably 35 pilots in Canada <clears throat> to fly these things. This guy's talking about some type of outbreak. Is this like is this like the gonorrhea outbreak of Gridania? I mean, when you got cat people sleeping with elves and and Lalafels, surely there's going to be a lot of uh, sexually transmitted diseases going out. And you can't just stick your dick into a tree and, and have it go away. 
DJ, there's only one word to say to that. Nice. Yeah, Baker beat me to it. Oh. All right, I got I got one high potion. Wow. Oh, just talking about shop, baby. Let's talk about you and me. Let's talk about the only thing I'm talking about that shop, baby. I don't even think that's the that's the that's the song. What did we get there? A oh, foot graze. Whatever. Oh. You would like something, eh? Well, I gotta talk to this guy. Surveying damage. Oh, oh my god, they make hemp clothing? Oh. Alright then. Ah, uh, such an embarrassing turn of events. I sent a recruit from the Bannock on a surveying expedition only for the Craven to turn tail and flee at the first sign of trouble. This is not how we treat requests from the Conjurers. And if such a poor showing weren't bad enough, the lily-livered half-wit, I love that, uh, left behind the surveying equipment provided by the hearer Pauline herself. Can you go get uh, that gear, please? I think so. I can do it for you. Absolutely. First little bit of trouble and this guy just uh just fucks right off, eh? That fine works nice. Ooh, he cards me good. I assume this is where these things are, right? You know? If that's where the, the map is showing me. Level 10? That's not bad in nearly three hours? I don't know if that's really good or bad, but probably terrible. You stay there. Okay, Mr. Yarzon. That is your real name. Starting from literally nothing, that's not bad. I mean, especially when I'm streaming, right? You know, I, I have to entertain the masses. And then I had to be, I had to deal with being stalked by Bunny, who was playing dead most of the time. And uh, uh, you know, a ninja red mage or something, it was terrifying. Yarzon, Yog Sauron? Is that the guy from Lord of the Rings? Oh my god, it's two o'clock. I'd like to hit 15 if I could before I before I bounce off for the day. Uh, no, it's one of the old gods from WoW was uh, end boss of Old Juar in Wrath of the Lich King. Oh. And you go into these nightmares. Bogs, Yogs. I'm not dealing with you guys. I'm just going to run away be my fat cat. <laughs> if you want to turn me on, ladies and gentlemen, if, if you run into me in this game, all it takes for you to put a smile on my face is a pet. That's it. You know, I'll, I'll be ecstatic. Every day I stream this, I want to have a new pet. Uh, so, I mean, I do have money of my own, but I don't want to spend my own money. I'm like a billionaire now. So I, I want I want other people to spend their hard-earned money and buy me pets. Can I... Sorry if I'm if I'm if I'm uh, incorrect here. Do I need a retainer to buy things from the market, or is that only if I want to sell things at the market? Like if I want to buy a bunch of minions, can I just buy some? I might just come back to the game and follow you around while completely naked. Oh, now that now now are you also a cat person? Uh, now Wolf Slayer. Rather embarrassing of me currently. You say the latter. I can't remember what I said last. Hush. That's 
that's how embarrassing my brain is. It really is. <clears throat> but I, I, I think if I remember correctly, I can, I just can't sell things, but I can buy things, right? I don't need a retainer to buy things. I mean, I'm, I'm just salivating at the thought of having Baker follow me around naked. I, I, I can't get it out of my mind. I'd be a naked row, row, row garden. Cannot sell without a retainer. Okay. The big guys. Oh. You do get two free retainers, though. Okay. Jinx. Uh... One of you two owes one of you is a Coke. That's how that works. <clears throat> Fled at the first sign of danger, he'd say. Well, all is not lost. It appears the recruit managed to complete the surveying assignment, and the records are actually quite detailed. With the changes wrought by the calamity, it would be wise to send the Order of the Twin Adder and a number of expeditions to map the region's topography. As fortune would have it, the officers saw the tasks as an excellent opportunity to train inexperienced soldiers. We can no longer rely on our past knowledge of the Twelves Wood. If we are to survive these troubled times, we must reacquaint ourselves with the surroundings that we may better discern the threats we face. Stay vigilant, adventurer. Give me my hemp actin! Okay? Right on the groin again. Can't see the groin. Is that like a quilted blanket or something? Looking pretty there. Pauline, you have a you have a soldier's breakfast quest here. Okay. Now you need me to kick the anoles and take the scalekins. Oh my god, why do they want me to kill the wildlife? Technically, Jordan read out the messages, therefore he is also jinxed. No talking for the rest of the stream. What if I just provide them with Coke? I hesitate to make a dangerous request here, but can you uh, help me out with the anal, 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 anal people on Naked Rock? I can certainly help you with the naked people on Naked Rock. How many anuses am I going to see at Naked Rock? I mean, if you see one, it's one too many. <clears throat> Alright, and I have to take their eggs apparently. It's also super mean. Can you imagine you just came up to someone with their anus. You saw an egg popping out and you had to take it while they were naked at a place called Naked Rock. I would never recover. Where is our where's our other forest people? Uh, North Shroud? Where are we currently? Central Shroud. Uh, Central Shroud. Oh, so these people might be here. Green Tier. And Brent. Oh, you can get those two. Reminder, you are the hero of the story. I am. I am the hero. I am right ahead. Reminds me of like when I was playing Honkai Star Rail. You know, listen to my story. How like they say that every fucking five seconds. I really want to be like, as much as I don't mind being a bard, like I like a DPS, like for the purposes of like when I get to dungeons, I really want to be a tank or something. Or a healer, maybe. I don't know. Then that, and then I can heal my favorite people. Right? I did! I'm actually playing it right now. Sort of just like on the side. Oh, you want me to get an egg? Where the fuck is an egg? Mother. That fucking scared the shit out of me, okay? Like, fuck's sakes. Like. If that wasn't in orange coloring, like I just see this spot. Like, what are you? What is that? Don't get him near me. What the fuck is that?
Is that a... Is that a mount? Where are you? Are you inside? It's a pink rhino. Yeah, no shit. No, you're one of the anal people. That's what's going on here. <clears throat> where, are these, where are these anals? It's currently a Fall Guys collab happening, and this is the mount you can get. Wait. Now, I've enjoyed me some Fall Guys. And I've seen videos of people playing the Final Fantasy Fall. Can I do that right now at my level? Or am I like, you know, is this only for, you know, high-level people? Oh, there's an egg. There's an a there's an anal egg we need. Yeah, I would I would like to try this if I could. I'm sure it's gonna be blocked out to me or something. I don't know why. I, I guess like this is a follow up to with with Chelsea um, and using uh, a controller. I don't know how people play MMOs without using an MMO mouse like I'm currently using. Like I don't, I don't, I don't know how you, how you do it. You need to advance in the story enough to get the proper place, but if you're lucky, you might be able to get it. Uh, it's around. To, uh, are you talking about uh, the uh, what the fuck is the casino called? Cactar or something? Golden Cactar? What the fuck is it called? I'm killing the anal people. Yes. Golden saucer. There it is. You play with a trackball. I wouldn't put it past you, to be honest. Like, I don't like... I, 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 I'm I, sitting here wondering, like, I know people do play these games, like, just, you know, the keyboard or whatever. But... Like, how do you hit all of the buttons, like, 1 through 10, while hitting W, like, while hitting Wasod? Um. Like, how do you do it all at once? Ow! Poser conf- Ah! I've returned with the, 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 the eggs of the anal people. Uh, can I deliver it to Tsubu Kagamamazun at the Bannock? Sure. I'm going to do all your fucking work for you, you fucking lazy pieces of Jordan's a fake fan. Conf God damn it. Everyone's here now. How you doing, little stars? <clears throat> Can't speak for others. I don't go past five on my keyboard. Wait, so, but... Oh, you stepped on my penis! But... There, what, what do you do when you have more moves than five? Are you using, like, the control? Like, the Kataro? What are you doing? I demand to know how it works for you, sir. Doing okay, have a raspy voice, but so you're just like myself. I use one, two, three, four, five. Oh, you're one of those fuckheads. You're even worse than I thought, Wolf Slayer. You're using the keyboard. Like how? Do you have extra fingers than 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 I do? Like, you had me up until using one, two, three, four, five, and then you threw an F E Q. What the fuck is wrong with you? And then you're throwing in Kataro, Alt, and Shift, and Plus, and what? Into the, I, what, what, I, well, let's, let's just look at what this guy is saying. Who goes there? Who the fuck is standing right in front of you? Like, like who goes there is something you say to someone on the other side of a door you can't see through or something. Q is your ranged attacks. E is for my AoEs. And F is my big damage skills. But like, don't you hit those num Don't you hit those things by accident all the time? Here's your anal egg.
Like, I don't have fat fingers. But my fingers don't fing to the best of them. Like, I'd be just like, I might as well just go, like, motorboat and son of a bitch on my keyboard. That's what I'd be doing. Huh? What do we have now? Another bow? A maple longbow. Another one from Canada. I'll take it. It's a good thing, not like Jordan, but uh, the damage explains a lot with it. Whoa. Oh, we went from a maple Canadian short bow to a maple long bow. I get ya. Now I can shoot farther, I bet. I'm sure it doesn't really matter, but. How was your weekend, Lothars? Oh, the gods have come. I mean, I, yeah, I hope that they were wearing a, a condom or, uh, you know, some type of protection when they're coming. Um, a potential crisis on our hands. Yeah, gods are coming. That's a problem. Fortunately, I will hear you out. The whole last two weeks have been crazy busy. No time it felt like, but it's been good. Well, you know, I, I hope it's slowed down for you now. You have two weeks off and it felt like no rest. I mean, I'm off right now. And it feels like I, I it don't, it, it don't stop. <clears throat> Listen well, for we haven't much time. To the southeast of here lies a dungeon known as the Spirit Hold. It's all but destroyed during the calamity. Desiring to offer the ruins back to the forest, a hero ventured inside to carry out the rite of returning, and it would seem something has gone awry. The guards have been attacked by a towering shadow. You heard me. A shadow. Uh, I worked all weekend, but uh, it's okay because now I'm off all this week. So um, this guy is sending the... Wait, what is, ha what is happening with the shadows right now? Why are they moving so slowly through... Why is the sun having this effect? Again with these Ixel people. First it was, you know, steal the anal eggs, and now it's back to the Ixel people. The Spirit Hole. That is Wolf Slayer's nickname for his bum hole. Wow. Oh, okay. So. Trying to figure out if I even want to word this in any way, shape, or form. Let's say he's had some, some Taco Bell. And, you know, it's it's run its course. And he might be ooh, a little further away from the from from the washroom or the bathroom uh, than he'd like to be. Does he just go out and yell my spirit hole? She's a leaking. And, uh, and and then I don't know whether or not he makes it to. Now, if his bum is called the spirit hole, is the toilet or the bidet called the spirit taker? They told you about the spirit hole in game. They're telling you about wolf's butthole. Okay. Oh, Baker. Just when we were starting to get good. Everything was just getting exciting. My toilet has a plaque on it that says the afterlife. Probably concerning. Uh, I'm gonna go down here through the bent branch and then work my way up through this, 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 this. Can you stop scaring me? Oh my God, I'm on fire. He's on fire. I didn't know you enjoyed some NBA jam. How many of these things that you're showing off to me right now, uh, uh, Chelsea, uh, required real money? <clears throat> and how many things of it just required your time? This will come up in future therapy sessions. Now, are you talking about my future therapy sessions or your therapy sessions 
Only one so far, I have others, but most of my stuff... Oh, that's good. Because I like a lot of the things you were showing off, but I was... I was a little worried that I would have to spend my... My hard... My hard-earned Canadian dollar reduce. My, my toonies and loonies. Use Wolf Slayer's Spirit Hole to get to them. I mean, I have heard stories that, uh, that Wolf Slayer has, does enjoy uh, some anal. Um, perhaps too much information has just been shared there. And then, uh, well, that's where you get the... Uh, that's the therapy session. <clears throat> yeah, uh, we went there. I mean, who? Who doesn't enjoy a good pegging every once in a while, right? Perhaps I've said too much. <laughs> oh, God. You know, the unfortunate thing is here is that if this stuff was clipped, I don't even know if this is this is worthy of sharing on YouTube. I mean, I might have to put my channel on Pornhub. <clears throat> Doubtless you already know this, but a towering shadow manifested without warning and attacked the Harpon here, the here. Okay, so someone has gone into this hut, not not this hut, uh, the pizza hut. Um, we gotta find them. But well, they've gone in here. Is that what you're telling me? Ah, don't step on the fire. Some trickster imps, also part of the, uh, hunting logue. What a worried wood whaler. Who would have thunk it? <clears throat> Look, I mean, if, 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 if I don't show up for a stream tomorrow, and you go to the channel, and it's just a picture of that guy that like just goes like this. Uh, you're 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 gonna you can say that you know why, right? I don't know what that emote is like. You know the one like where the guy that's like you know when that when the stream is is not around anymore. That one. When that happens, you'll know why. Jordan realizes he said too much. Pauses. Who doesn't love a good pegging now and then? The <laughs> Seinfeld music plays. I feel like. Wouldn't that be more of a, um, what's the other one that Larry David did? Wouldn't it, wouldn't it be that music instead? The bum, 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 curb or something? Curbing your desires? No, that isn't right. Curbing, curbing something. Curb your, curbing your desires. My fucking god. Okay. Yeah, I would have thought like you know instead of Seinfeld. I mean, I think it both fits, Baker. It really does. But you know. So instead of these fucking five useless wood whalers just walking down this fucking path out this door, they fucking just decided to just fucking call it a day and go, well, I'm fucking dead. are dead. I heard that's a good show to watch. Is is Curb Your Enthusiasm a good show? I, if I like Seinfeld? I just can't even picture a Lalafell carrying around this longbow. It would look hilarious. I can only go off of clips uh, where it relatively looks funny. It's a good show. Uh-oh. 
mournful voice of creation, grant ye this humble stone a soul. They said it too fast. Can I slow that down a little bit? Uh oh. Oh my god, it's Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Uh, after the steroids. Always Sunny. Isn't that the one with uh, Danny DeVito? Play Gollum. Another show I have not watched that I probably should watch. I don't know why I shot heavy at that guy. It probably was irrelevant. Is there anybody else helping me here? Or am I, like, just doing this on my own? What happened to that black mage? Ah! Ah, duty. The duty's complete. Golem could have been vanquished. That man is no ordinary adventurer. I'm sorry, was someone talking over there? Hi? Sir? Ma'am? Do you like to be pegged? Damnation, he's eluded us yet again. Oh, fancy meeting you here. How are things? Uh, good. <clears throat> Square Enix games and people wearing hoods. Oh god, why is it every time these people show up, I collapse? I have a headache again. More birds. Seven this time? Their movements are beyond fathoming. You know, maybe if you took those things off your eyes, you might be able to see what's going on. You think they're trying to summon their primal? Well, I hope not, but you must be prepared for the worst. <clears throat> Is this like a, a, a look back in the past or something? Dalamud's anomalies affecting life in the Twelves Wood. Or is this before, is this, are they showing this before the Calamity or something? Uh, basically, I, I hit like level 50, but I don't remember any of the story of A Realm Reborn. Like, I want to say Beastmen. Um, I remember there's a Darth Vader guy. Um, multiple Darth Vader type people that they look like they have, uh, they're part of the, uh, the Empire. <clears throat> That's about it. Well, if you ask me, they're an improvement over that mask of yours. Hard to believe it's already been five whole years, isn't it? Already? Five years is but a heartbeat in the life of a planet. <clears throat> I suppose you're right. Now that I think about it, the Wolves would barely recovered at all, and the Gridanians still have the same old problems. Aye. Along with some new ones, just in case the Ixel and Garuda weren't troublesome enough, the Sylphs had to go and invite Rama, didn't they? Do you ever think about those adventurers who fought alongside us? I do. And then five years seems like ages. I wonder what became of them. Ah. Uh. Gita, look. <clears throat> Does this, like, allow them to see, like, spirit veins or something like that? Golly! And what is that exactly? Well, you get another disturbance in the Aether. Freshly manicured, this one. 
emanating from the life oh. <clears throat> that's where we found the uh that's uh that sword that we pulled out because we thought it was the master sword and we we're gonna save zelda or something There's no shaking these bad vibes <clears throat> are you all right your eyes glazed over there for a while The good news is that the hearer is unharmed. Somewhat dazed, but you know, whole mind and body. Bad news is concerns everything else. Lest you forget, the twelve swords is the domain of the elements. This by the leave, the man abides in the force and avails himself of its bounty. The ground which the dungeon occupies is no different. <clears throat> Having no more use for the dungeon, the Gridanians sent a hearer to offer the place back to the elementals by way of the right of returning, which it's essentially an expression of the gratitude. Alas, he failed to complete the ritual for obvious reasons. <clears throat> While the poor soul cannot be blamed for this, it remains unless the elementals are given their due, you may consider it a slight. The last thing we want to do is piss these eternal guardians off. But you have more than done your part. You shall see the here to safety and... Send for his peers to finish the right. In the meantime, make your way outside and report this to Alston. Oh, where are my manners? I am Poppy Limo. And that tactless woman beside me is... Ida? You're surveying the Twelve's Wood together. <clears throat> Hi. Ida, give me a hand, would you? They're like a they're like a married couple, aren't they? Just squabbling back and forth. <clears throat> Wait, there is something familiar about you. Could it be that you are Never mind. Doubtless my eyes are playing tricks. Till we meet again. Well, unfortunately, you're gonna have to head out. Nice to chat. Can't make promises being around as often as I'd like, but I'll try Baker. Thank you very much for hopping on in. It's always a pleasure. Uh, to see a uh, front. <sighs> Have yourself a good one, Baker. Enjoy your evening, buddy. Cheers uh, with my empty glass. It's probably really bad vibes to do, but uh, have one on me. What the fuck is that thing? I'm gonna go up to this thing and say, "Don't e don't you even don't no no no, damn it she came in god damn it no 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 maybe maybe you get stuck here, be great ha I win again Chelsea win again. I gotta go chat it up with this ale guy. <clears throat> What's happening inside? Really? You came all this way, huh? You jackass. Alright. But who's that masked mage and. What dark ambition is he driven? So many things shrouded in mystery. Well, I shan't find the answers on my own. I must needs discuss this with Galf. The matter warrants a full investigation. If I'm any judge, and that shall certainly be my recommendation. Your courage has saved many lives this day, adventurer. For this, you may have my deepest of gratitude. Pray return to Gridania and seek out Mion. I'm sure I'm getting her name. I just noticed you now. Just, I swear to God, if it wasn't for the orange name. Fuck! <sighs> Terrifying. What is that thing? You kids. I'd be curious to see how much we could get away with if you turned. I'd, I'd be afraid of 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 that. <clears throat> Roselette in the central shroud. 
probably going to be down this way. We'll see if we can get those before we head back to uh, Gridania. What I'll probably do, it's getting close to the time where I got to go pick up my son. So I'll probably uh, see if I can find those roselets and hand in these two quests and we will call it a day. I'm trying to figure. I mean, I want to keep everyone happy. But I really want to play Final Fantasy VIII tomorrow. But then I feel like, is that too much Final Fantasy? I mean, one would argue that it's never enough Final Fantasy. <clears throat> well, thanks for hopping on in, Wolf Slayer. And thank you for all of the help and, you know, scaring me and keeping me in line and whatnot and yeah there, there will be more of this there will be more of this like i said i think honestly if i can if i can keep it like where we're, we're just you know doing the these things you know you know not too much of you know side quests and, and keep it to the story I, I i think we'll be good there they are I don't know, DJ. I really don't know. I, I really want to start Final Fantasy VIII. But that just might mean, like, I might do a double up of, like, a Wednesday, Thursday, Cold Steel type of thing. No, we can't. No, otherwise I'll forget how to play that damn game. game. <clears throat> You know, I, I that's another game like again in the in the background of everything I've I've been I've been playing and testing to make sure that the mods and everything are all working and all that jazz so like you know I'm, I'm playing a game but I can't really share you know my experience or anything and so like you know it's hard to stop so I, I've, I've been really just wanting to get into it Where are we? Where are we heading off to? We are going off to I think just Gridania, right? Yeah, probably. Yeah. I assume I can't join the uh, the free company until I'm properly on Leviathan, right? <clears throat> Is that how that works? hit 13 with that that's not bad it's not quite the 15 i wanted to hit but we did some good work today and, and able and, and you know what i find is like at the same time is when i play this on my own you know to do some side quests maybe learn a, a couple different classes you know i i, I won't be missing story because i'll save that for the stream so like taking the approach of of this of Playing just the you know I'm understanding what's going on in the story instead of like going like oh I need to kill fucking four fungars again like Jesus Christ uh, it's not getting all lost in the in the shuffle. Lots of side quests. Too. So what's here? It's it's Lancer and Conjurer, I believe, right? Well, a little bird tells me that the here and his party owe you their lives. A tale for the tavern, if there ever was one. It's only a shame that I must ask you not to tell, for the time being at least. Do I make myself clear? Until the hears have made their will on the matter known, it would be best to avoid unsettling people with stories of walking statues. Now then, 
You must have suitable recompense for your valiant service. For Safia's reward, I give you leave to make use of the accommodations here at the guild. Arrangements have been made, so all you gotta do is just speak with Antoinette whenever you crave the comfort of a firm bed and a soft pillow. <clears throat> all right, we can rest at an inn now. For the second half of your reward, I offer you another path of fame to fortune, guild levies. Uh, those are records of various requests we receive from the citizenry, outline all men. So those are like little quests to do, if I can remember. In an area, you turn it on, you know, you, you set whether you want it to be harder or, or easier, and uh, you can do those when you sort of run out of quests, I think, if I remember. <clears throat> They're available in every area, I believe. And then uh, there's a coming festival. And forward to young and old, and one I heartily recommend you take time to enjoy. I will. But don't be too disappointed. The recent troubles cast a shadow over proceedings. Nothing short of a mysterious interloper's apprehension can prevent that. But you made Mother proud. I expect great things of you, young man. Thank you. We got some Earth Shard. <laughs> I love the little ears that just move there, you know, after just show how happy I am. Uh, oh, yes, the recommendations list. That's going to show a bunch of things that you can do. Um, we will pick up the next side quest. I'll leave that there because we can grab that. We'll just hand in the next one. Here. It's having a bit of cup of tea. Wait, in this game, you can sit on. Oh, don't tell me in all this time. I've never known that you can sit. I'll be damned. Where'd you get the pizza? Are you, are you wearing like lingerie? What are you wearing? You can wave at the same time? Yeah. Very comfy clothes. I mean, lingerie can be comfy, right? Pizza emote was a Grubhub promo. What the fuck is Grubhub? Oh, like Uber Eats? Just another like one of those? <clears throat> okay. I mean, I guess I could say the same. I don't know, like, do you have skip the dishes? And I think DoorDash. Those are the only one. The, those are the only other ones I know of. <clears throat> now these elves are giants. Well, tell me, were you able to put your techniques to good use? I think so. Faced with an enemy who can attack from a distance, simply raining arrows upon them is wasteful and dangerous. Basically, if you place an order with a promo code during a set amount of time, you'd get the emote code via email. Only Grubhub fucked up royally and made a lot of people never get their emote. Wolf was one of them. So, and is that one of those things of where, like, now you can never get that emote? Leah? So there? Very limited time after. Well, that sucked. Well, if you ask me, the adventurer pulls a good bow. Hi, Leah. Leah Aliopo. Her second year at the gill here. <clears throat> and you have fangs, it looks like. You had your eye on me during my duration of my trial, but not once did I notice your presence. So not only do I have Fiery Biscuits and Wolf Slayer watching me, I had Leah Aliopopopo watching me as well. You got Uber Eats, DoorDash, and Grubhub. Grubhub, I don't use any. Okay. Yeah, we, we don't have Grubhub here in Canada. 
<clears throat> I mean, they're, it's funny, like, I mean, they're all the same, but, like, I guess, like, for us over here, like, the biggest one is, is Uber Eats, but I know a lot of people don't like Uber Eats because it's Uber. Um, but they have, like, access to most of the restaurants. Looks like the Silver guy is not too pleased. Wait, is he is he is he racist against cat people? Does he look like he was an elf and I was a cat person? And he's like he's like a, an outsider learning my archery. Oh, he's like that to everyone. Okay. <clears throat> well, we'd be much lucky to get some sense out of a fossil brain wildwood elizin, but it's times like this that uh, oh sorry we didn't realize that there's more elizin here. But it, like, when that happens, don't you just hit like, you know, order was not delivered and then you get your money back? I mean, I know it still sucks that you don't get your food, but I mean, there's also like, you know, the people who take the picture of like them delivering your food and then taking the food afterwards. And then they get caught on like the ring camera or whatever. I thought that said ashtray and I was like, what? Smoke it. Go now and resume our training. We look forward to marking your progress the next time we meet. All right, so it looks like we're getting a new bow, which is not better than the current one we have. Um, gloves might be good. Level five gloves. All right. So, I'm going to put those on. Hopefully, those gloves don't make me look like a clown. Red glove. They clash a little too much. Right? But uh, uh, that's going to do it uh, for me for today. I got to go pick up the little guy. And uh, then I'm going out uh, for dinner with the in-laws. And uh, I'll be back tomorrow. Looking like Final Fantasy VIII tomorrow, I think. And then uh, maybe we'll double up uh, Old Steel like Wednesday, Thursday type of thing. Uh, thank you all who came on. Do you not understand how creepy that looks? <laughs> see, see, the funny thing is, the funny thing is, had your not name have been there, I probably wouldn't have even like thought anything oh, of of someone standing there. I would have just assumed you were another sprout like me. But seeing the name there makes it extra creepy. Uh, thank you all as Kenny Omega says, it's time for me to bounce out and say goodbye and good night. Dang. Hit it, Chelsea. See you later, guys. All the best. Yeah, indeed. Thanks, guys. See you tomorrow.